BS got updated and it looks different. All right. Obs. Um. <clears throat> All right. Hello. And welcome. Um. We're continuing Life is Strange 2. I'm thinking probably. Um. Uh, We'll probably do two chapters today. And then finish the last two chapters tomorrow. Maybe. We'll see. Twitch. Um, ba 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 ba. Let's see, promotions. All right, just gotta announce my stream everywhere. Just give me two seconds. Add stream notification. Um, honorable notifs, uh, stream shoutouts, alright, cool, okay, let's, uh, a form, I need to find out. Um, let me turn off that one. Let's see if my other controller has more charge than that. Yes. Hold on. This might be the right charger for it. Okay, I can use this wire to charge my white one, if anything. Okay. Uh, let's see if this has any charge at all. I haven't used this controller in, like, so long. So that's probably why it's like, THERE'S AN UPDATE! Ah! <laughs> so we should be able to do this fairly quickly. Yeah, I have two controllers, but I just rarely ever use my red one. I don't know why, though. It's pretty cool. Anyways, uh... Uh, save file has been... Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit. Captain Spirit. Uh, we'll proceed anyway. That is another game that links to... Uh, Life is Strange. But I don't have the time to download it right now, so... Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but... One day, hunters took their dad away. Bro, that's a strong ass ghost you got there. For to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods. Barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful Sorry, I plugged in my controller. There we go. Orchard, and we're able to eat in peace. Nobody. Okay. Yeah. But they didn't know. Felt devious. Hunters tried to tie them up, but the Wolf Brothers managed to escape with the help of a friendly bear. He 
show them how to survive and help them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. A super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of the Fox, where they hope to find peace. So in summary, they're making their way to Mexico. To our grandparents. December 1st, 2016. Willamette National Forest, Oregon. I've been there! I used to live in the Willamette area. Nobody cares, Dolphin Game Boy. Well, it's all cutscenes, so it's not like, you know. Mush! Try with this one. That one's too easy. Look. Don't brag. It was too heavy for you a few days ago. something else not too heavy though I'm a little tired hey mushroom I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us yeah something feels weird about this controller ship okay not your usual shooting range right Uh, you could try and lift mushroom. Are you kidding? <laughs> I don't wanna hurt her. Yeah, yeah, you're probably right. Let's leave the puppy. Absorbing the echo. Nah, he's just using the force. How about those cans? Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure. Look. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. Okay. Let's show Daniel some more stuff to play with before we call it a day. Oh, I guess I have to go this way. Move, bitch! Oh, we have a switchblade now. And a whole bunch more pine cones. Brody got us a room. He's a boss. Uh, he even left some cash. Will we meet him again one day? Chilling a bit, been ages. Real beds, almost too comfy to be true. Miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. I had to call Layla one last time. I missed her laugh. Hope she won't get in trouble. New phone went out. Now phone went out for a midnight swim. Safer that way, off the radar. What the actual fuck? What's happening to Daniel? What is he? When did that start? Same thing in Seattle. Fuck, what will I do? On the road again, gotta find ourselves a hideout. Then Puerto Lobos. Need money and supplies before we head to Puerto Lobos. We'll hide somewhere till we find out what the fuck is up with Daniel. No fucking idea how we'll handle this. Tired. Try to sleep now. Weird. Warm. Home? Warm? So I don't know. We're getting off at the next station, whenever that is. Where? Charity thrift store in some town. Southeast of Albany. I used to work there. 
uh found layers for Daniel and me uh Harry was cool slept in someone's backyard shed uh would not recommend it itches the sour walk why Albany uh I worked at a target distribution center there uh sleeping in a shelter fake names they didn't seem to give a fuck no one seems to give a fuck here they even let mush in invisible uh leaving town crackhead at the shelter almost snatched a stuff last night daniel freaked out and lights flickered can't have an can't risk another incident oh huge thanks for this sub later manor it's the one and only later manor connor watching other streamers yeah right uh can't risk another incident heading out for the forest again too dangerous to have him around people for now uh hitchhiked along highway 20 geologist on her way to mount jefferson i've been there picked up i'm i'll stop i'll stop not big on talking told her we were on a survivalist trip lamau uh, most accurate lie I've ever told. Told. Oh my god, we found a, a house. A real fucking house. Looks like an abandoned cabin. No one has been here for years. Uh, was just... Here waiting for us. Hansel and Gretel style. Settled in. Had to leave Daniel to look for food. He hates me. Uh, I hate myself too for leaving him alone. Cabin in the woods. Uh... Form, you redeem Mega Gold, but I don't have water, so you're gonna have to give me a sec. Actually, no, we're all gonna say hashtag Blade Form because now you guys don't get to watch me play. I have to go get water. How many racists will there be today? Who knows, man? <laughs> A lot, I guess. Oh, God. Spam the chat. You can put rewards on cooldown now. Yeah. We can't spam hydrate. Yeah, that's the point. <laughs> I can redeem it. Streaming's a game that's 50% cutscenes. Uh, 30% QTEs is like working out. Store is a greeter. 
stop telling your life experience to us. How many racists will there be today? Are we counting four? I'm not, I'm not racist. I just don't like people who are different. It's a joke, by the way. That's just racist. I'm... <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Let me get my uh, volume warning. All right. There you go. There's your, there's your mega gulp. Uh, okay. You're welcome. Oh, and hydration check. Well, yeah, you can redeem it, but there's like a two minute cooldown on it. I got a granola bar. It's a Reese's Puff granola bar. Anyways. Settled in, had to leave Daniel to look for food. He hates me. I hate myself for leaving him alone. Hope I don't get lost. Something about tarps. That was so intense. Ew. Yeah, why did he put West on top? That's weird. Oh. Um. I managed to steal canned food from a couple stores. Found the rest in the garbage. Getting good at this, but not pr But not proud. last two weeks on this nearest town is 15 minutes away across the forest no way i can commute there every day they're catching animals <laughs> on my way back daniel okay he built something around the house um, practice starts tomorrow. Focus it. Um, they made a game. Dan and Shroom. He did it. Back to town today. Walk slower with the snow. Daniel got sick. Um, we went to get some medicine. Daniel somehow found crayons. <laughs> it's cheating at dice game. Uh, yeah, Camizo, Loki told me that you guys are streaming Tiny Tina's something later. You're being bullied for him? Oh no. I'm too busy playing the game. How about see? that one? I can do it with the small rocks, but not the big ones. Oh? You can do this. Trust me. Oh, the Just Tiny Tina's D and D relax. themed Borderlands game? Focus. I don't know. I'll try. Kind of ironic coming from form. What's Daniel doing? He's he's working on his powers. Is he a Jedi? Hey, yeah, kind of, I guess. Let's go. Whoa! Holy shit! I did it. <laughs> Like a boss, you're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest rock ever. Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Anticlimactic. He's using his powers of racism to move the rock. A snowball fight? <laughs> Holy shit! This is a new exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool. Okay. Not Maybe racist, you fuck. Like that time you gave me a bruise? Seriously. Thanks, Grace. You won't let Does anyone see a scan line moving right? from the bottom Try. of the screen on occasion? <sighs> Power of the deep south. Let me let me see. I think there is a way to fix that. Um it's just that screen tear. Uh 
Hold on, file, settings, stream. It's power of the deep sound. Uh, how to turn off. Um. So my uh, OBS got updated today, so I'm wondering if that's the issue. Uh, settings, output, recording, audio, replay, buffer, streaming. Ability advanced recording stream delay automatic reconnect network of sources hotkeys it has something to do with vsync but I can't find it in the settings I go now see ya come so didn't you say you stream that you'd let Kafka dom you what huh. Aww, that sucked. don't go crazy I'll over go it one more. Now it's still happening. Ready? Yes. Look, look what I can do, Sean. I knew that you could. I've taught you well. But you, you're a master student. <coughs> hey, that still sounds nasty. <coughs> you're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just. A little beat. Well, you need to rest now. <laughs> Superhero. Can we go back now? Yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. <gasps> that cough has been going on for days, Daniel. I really don't like that. I told you. I'm fine. We've just been outside for a while. Yeah, it's a, it's a game thing. It's oh, it's the the it's oh my god, what's it called? It's VSync. But if I go into my video settings here, the game doesn't have a VSync option. But that's what's causing the screen the screen tear. I've been told that before when I played a. Uh, oh my god, when I played Avatar, I was I had screen tear. Can you reset your capture card miracle. element on your OBS? Maybe. We can. Here we go. Here, let me try that. The hella tanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water ex. Yeah, let's try that. Strashin. Ranger DX. And then I'll see if it still does it. Nice work, Daniel. Glad to see our training sessions are paying off. Thanks to you. So glad I don't have to touch that water. It's too fucking cold. Uh, oops. Yeah, it looks better Sorry. now. I said fucking. <laughs> it's fine out here. There's no one to hear you curse. Mm -hmm. Whoa, kids squaring. Swearing kids in my video game? What what did you find, Shroom? Oh, what's this? A little rock pile. It's made by the goddamn aliens. Where are you going? Gotta leave these poor buttons alone. Children swearing in this economy? 
Look, Daniel. I think I saw that rabbit from the other day. Absolutely fucking home. not swearing won't be tolerated, you dumb funny. fuck. Dude, your face. Sean, you suck. <laughs> Come on, Daniel. I was just kidding around. <laughs> More on. No, nothing has activated that trap, I guess. Where are you going, This Pop? is <sighs> we really kind of creepy. This two-headed snow ogre. Yeah, they're really badass. And Musher isn't even Shit, he said more on. Right, puppy? Watch your profanity. <laughs> oh my god, the little puppy waddle. It's so cute. Ooh, cold. Don't worry. We'll make a fire. We're pros now. Dude, that cough doesn't sound too good. Nah, uh, I'm okay. Just cold. You kicked ass today. Yo, that Daniel's got ligma! I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Um, I will try my oh, best. No, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like, uh-oh. It's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just... Whatever. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. What's the first one? Uh, Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <sighs> Shut up. <laughs> and the final rule? I know... Come on. Um... You can do it. Okay. Um... Avoid danger? Run from danger. This is the most important one. Do you know why? Uh, I don't know. I mean, with my power, I can help us. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I had used it before. Dad might still be here. Shouldn't have let you alone? Daniel, it's my fault. Oh. I shouldn't have let you alone outside. But I didn't help. So Sean doesn't want him to use his power. I didn't do anything. Does. Well, he, he gets sick if he uses because his powers, but he's a kid, so, you know. Couldn't. Please never refer to Sean as Daddy Sean again. <laughs> Don't worry, Mushroom. I'm okay. Good puppy. She must be hungry. What about you? I'm always hungry. <laughs> Why? Let's grow back. Teen Dad Sean, there you I'll go. Some dinner. <laughs> yeah, before she eats us. <laughs> Empty scotch bottle. Daniel must have been pissed that day. Don't blame him. Summer 93, something? Agatha Falls, maybe? And, and Daddy Teen Dad Sean makes the best choices better. Robot ready for takeoff. Um, Three, 
I don't know. Two, one. Here, bubble bath medicine. Can I? No way I can give any of these to Daniel. Oh, those are like depression pills risky. and shit. Never mind. You never found the key to this door. There's a dead body I behind guess there. Using the sliding door is cool. The space scuba is hovering on a dead planet. Where did I put my lighter? Okay. If last lesson? First lesson. Something bottle, twigs and leaves. Can't believe how much Daniel's much. powers have improved over the last weeks. Oh, refill. Hey, Shroom. You thirsty? <laughs> Good girl. Where did you leave your lighter, my friend? I wonder how far it can go. No more batteries. I've been Thank misgendering God. the dog this whole time. <laughs> it's funny. High school feels so far away now. This thing is strong as a rock. Oh. Fuck did I put the lighter? Where's the lighter? Ah, uh, lighter. Time to get warm. Nice. Case closed, 22. And gold crap. Hold on, Mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. Do you wanna build a snowman? We'll ride our bikes around the halls. Dang, I am starving. Guess it's time to start cooking. Okay. Uh, Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. He looks so serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's wrong. I miss him so much it hurts, Sean. I know, Daniel. Mm. Talk to him. It's okay to think about him. Shut up, Dolphin. I'm gonna talk to Daniel after dinner. Form. What are you cooking? I think you need oh. to take a break today. I'm so tired of eating And go shit. sit in a corner and chill the I fuck just out. Want one slice of pizza. Oh, I'm sorry. Here's your menu choices. Ravioli or ravioli? Okay, okay. No. <sighs> Never eating this again. How long should the timeout be? <laughs> I'm so tired of eating the same shit. Grease is so I ready. I just want one slice of pizza. Is there a can opener somewhere? Was published before you even born, Sean. We really lucked out stumbling into this house. Is there a can opener somewhere? This can has the thing to open, though. 
Wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. I was gonna say, this power dynamic is skew one way. Poor guy. I guess kids have to grow up anyway, right? Yes, there's some here, and I love it. Tom knows everybody, and I keep waiting to meet Scarface. We're at his friend's killer condo with a beach view and a balcony. I feel so spoiled, but now I know John is at a castle in the Alps, so I don't feel bad. Plus, I really like it here. What a great way to start the new century. I miss our vacation at the Secret Lodge, I don't, but I don't miss raccoons in my room. Okay. Your First Amendment right. Don't I have a pocket that knife? Bridget totally looks like mushroom. Daniel's been sick for more than a week. I'm so tired of eating the same shit. I just want one slice of pizza. We're so lucky this thing is still working. How you doing, mushroom? Wouldn't have lasted long without E. You're the best puppy Daniel in the world. Daniel needs a doggo friend. Bro, what do I do? I'm just glad we found you. No more batting. Thank God. Kind of weird to use stranger stuff every day, but not like we have a choice. There was a little bit left when we came. Pretty disgusting, but these were all I found when I hit the town last week. I wish I helped Dad more with the house chores back then. I've clicked everything! This room is fucking cold, so we put everything we didn't need in it, and it feels almost good to be cut off from everything. Yep, no more indoor training sessions. Hello, motel room soap. Mm, Daniel can have that. Pro tip, always boil the water. Yeah, no shit. Unless you want Daniel spraying nasty things on both ends. Ew! Once you get used to squatting, eh, it's not so bad. <coughs> one pan, one wash, zero mess. At least we have fresh water in our front yard. Hey, I put some clean water in the bathroom so you can wash a little. It feels weird to loot other people's clothes, but we need the warmth. This is rank. <sighs> Sharing with Daniel was the worst. No more peeing at night for Daniel. He got so scared. We're lucky he didn't blow up the house. All right, I've clicked on fucking everything. Hmm. I could do a soup. He's the town fucking hero now. <laughs> How can I feel bad for him? The mysterious and controversial Seattle incident that left two dead has released a statement regarding the threats she received from the online critics of the officer. My brother was a kind man. He was in the force for only six months and shouldn't have been alone that day. My heart is with the Diaz family and all the victims of that terrible incident, including us. The police department needs better funding, so no officer goes on patrol alone if their partner is sick or unavailable. Kindred dedicated his life uh, to helping others, especially children in at-risk home, and he always volunteered his time for charity. It's easy for people to judge an attack behind a keyboard, but... Just as we mourn for others, we mourn for the loss of the brave public servant. Wonder where Brody is now. Oh yeah. No in Yeah. Daniel doesn't need to see this. Mr. Patrick Hill? Oh. That's who owned this house, I'm guessing.
I don't know what to do. We scored with these clothes. Plus five street cred. <laughs> Dude, <coughs> you'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. You really think so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, I think we'd know it by now. Dude, what the fuck do I do here? As badass as it would be, there's no way we'll heat our food without a pan. So, do I need to get the pan out of the bathroom? There we go. Tanya needs to eat something after all that psychic crap. I just phased through my brother. It's his new power, don't worry. <laughs> nah, it's not ready yet. I'm a ravioli expert. Bro, now. what is this kid on? This house is cool, but it doesn't help with Daniel's health. All right, Daniel. Excuse me. This Magneto Ready for shit. Ready training, puppy? Say it. Do you still have the backpack beers? No, we used those. Room, sit. Seriously, girl. Sit. Mushroom. Sit, girl. Huh? <laughs> Are you kidding me? You just don't know how to talk to her. I'll remember this. Traitor. Uh. <sighs> okay. Dinner's ready. Yeah, I gave the backpack beers to the nine-year-old kid. I'm kidding. <laughs> Legally required to say that's a joke. Getting sick of ravioli. Bro, ravioli's fire. This is real food. It's better than nothing. I'm just tired of the same thing. I love ravioli. You want it, mushroom? <laughs> Why does it move like that? Daniel, come on. I know. Hide my powers. But it's just you and me and puppy. Yeah, but you're getting I sick. I want you to get in the habit. <coughs> exactly. <coughs> Ow. The puppy finna snitch! Sorry. I'm cool. <sighs> Hold on. I need to show you something. Um, Let me tell something to you. Okay. Gotta show him the map. I think I left it with my books. Mm. Nothing here. Daniel? What did you do with the map? What do you mean? You know what I mean. Did he put it in the fire? Where's the map that was with my stuff? Oh, this map. 
It's in my tent. Sorry, Sean. Hey, lovely. Okay, come on, doggy. Let's go, girl. Hey, man. Can you call your dog? They don't exist. Mushroom. Come here, girl. You guys ever watched that movie? Um, oh my god. What was it called? Is it The Fall? No. A great team. What's the name of that movie? Hey, Alex. Uh... Oh my god. Movie about two girls stuck on a TV tower. Fall. Uh, that moment right there reminded me of that, because it's like him saying I'm invisible. It's like, what if this is all just a figment of uh, what's his name's imagination kind of thing? Or like, he trauma, you know, all of this. There's someone at the door. What the fuck? What the? When did he show up? I don't know. Mother... Th Daniel? <laughs> Got you! <laughs> it's all a dream. I don't know, I wanna do stuff. <laughs> you almost shit your pants. Of course I did, man. Anyway... Um... So it's like, what if it's like a trauma kind of thing okay. that Daniel is like imagining I that think. Sean has been here this whole time, but he hasn't? It's time for us to hit the road. You're not getting better. <sighs> As a trauma You're response. Five. No, I'm okay. <clears throat> You're, You're literally not okay. Yeah, though. a bad cop that won't go away. <sighs> Trust me, Daniel. You need some medicine. Look, here. Beaver Creek? What's that? That's where Karen's parents, our grandparents live. Okay. His mom's name is Karen! What? So we can Let's go! go. They'll probably help us. Why do you always force us to run, Sean? Alex, thanks for the One gifted sub. Don't like you. <laughs> Yo, thanks. Um, uh, they're family. They're family, right? Plus, they always for what Karen, for what Mom did. Um, you sure? It would be cool to spend Christmas with our grandparents. Man, they're kind of loving me. Ads are indeed Grandpa's annoying, Alex. Cool I'm sure. No longer can my shitty book. jokes be suppressed by ads. Mushroom has to agree too. He's part of the team. What do you say, girl? <laughs> okay, when? Tomorrow. Which low key smart if they made the ads better. annoying as hell just to drive up subs. Yeah, that is smart. Hmm. We should do something fun for our last night here. How about a game of dice? If I win, I get the draw on your backpack. You know I'm gonna win and draw a dick on your bag, right? <laughs> I don't think so, pussy. Party time. What the fuck did you just call me? Okay. Bitch. Ready to lose, Captain. Watch your butt, matey. Here we go. Just need a six, and a five, and... And a four. Oh! This ship is mine. <laughs> Captain's ready to rule. Ahoy! I have a crew now. Here comes the loot. <sighs> Rather than nothing. <laughs> Here you go, cargo. Oh! I'm a sucky pirate. <laughs> this or the pink haired dude? The dyes are yours. Nice. All 
right? I just need a four now. Oh! Come on. Give me something. Anything. Phew. It was a close one. And he won. Ah, pretty good. He's fucking the rules okay. with his powers, probably. Let me now. <sighs> Sheesh. I can't use that one as a. I need a ship. Oh, you need a ship need first. Six. Still incomplete. Sounds like hell? a no score. Hey! I wonder what we would have done if we didn't find these dice. I don't know. Probably read all these books. Uh, boring. You remember that time I beat Dad at chess? He flipped one! You mean, we beat Dad. Yeah, you did help me distract them. <laughs> Bet he would have liked this game. <sighs> Definitely. He was a great pirate. Just like us. Captain Diaz, king of the seas. I need the score now. Pretty please. Oh, that's a nice score. <sighs> I'm so scared. And I win. 24. You know what it means? <sighs> yeah, okay. You won. Here's my bag. Mmm, let's see. Luffy, hey, what are you king of the pirates. <laughs> Is that mushroom? Yes. I know I'm not as good as you, but... Nah, it's it's really cool, dude. Thanks. So let's do another one. One piece. One piece. It's strange too. <laughs> uh, it's getting late. It's bedtime. Gotta get up early. I'm gonna finish my comic book. She has to pee. Okay, okay. I'll take her out for a walk. You're going to smoke. It smells like ass. You're right. D don't smoke. Yeah. <laughs> but it's our last night, so we can do anything. <sighs> all right, all right. I heard you the first time, dude. I asked somebody who smokes recently, I was like, what does it feel like? They're like, it feels like the happiest and quickest high of your life. And I was like, that doesn't sound worth it for the lung damage. And he was like, no, it's not. But it's addicting, so. And I was like, oh, well, okay. <laughs> Like, I'm, I'm the type that's like, oh, try anything once, but anything addicting is where I draw the line. I'm like, no. And hard drugs. I don't want to try that. I don't need to. The bad outweighs the good in my eyes. Yeah, exactly. I'll try all drugs on my deathbed. Well, yeah, if you're on your deathbed. Like, might as well. Yeah. Like, okay, if I got told 
I'm not gonna lie. If I got told, like, you have terminal cancer, you have two months to live or some shit like that, or, like, you have six months to live, then I would be like, all right. Yeah. I'll do it. My mom, one time, uh, she was in a lot of pain and we had to go to the hospital and she got, uh, morphine, um, since morphine is also a painkiller, um, and she told me, she was like, I hated it. <laughs> it was awful. How do people get addicted to that? <laughs> it's, she was like, it was awful. She goes, the second, she said, the, the second the liquid touched her, like, like the IV thing that was in her, her arm. She goes, instantly, full body chills, and I felt like throwing up. And I was like, that sucks. She goes, I don't understand how people get addicted to that. I was like, I don't know, man. Feels good to somebody, I guess. Because, I mean, yeah, I think about it. It's a painkiller, you know? It's like being addicted to opioids. So it's like... I enjoy the feeling I guess I guess they it, it would I've obviously never had morphine but it's I'm guessing it numbs you um because like I said it's a painkiller hey, it's just a very doing? very fast working one I'm coming um so I guess just like they get addicted to that numbness feeling of like not being able to feel anything mushroom wants to go out don't you hear yeah sorry Move. So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. It's fucking bullshit. Hey, cool down. It's gonna be okay. I know. But... What did you pack in? What the f... Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Next time I get the chance, I'll ask Don't worry. him. <coughs> yeah. Your super strong big brother can help. I knew a guy who tried uh, LSD, I think, and he said it was awesome. he said it was great, but well, um, it looks like we're almost. He was there. like, if you don't like like hallucinating, then That's it's not for you. I was like, I probably wouldn't Still like that. Peeing, I guess. I'm gonna check what she's up to. But he was like, it was weird. Okay. I was like, okay, well, well, I will never guys. try it. But you know. I don't need to pack anything else. I legit knew someone who took LSD and were convinced their dick turned into a caterpillar and ran away from him. No! No! Oh, poor guy, honestly. <laughs> then the popcorn ceiling okay. started melting for him at one point. Yeah, see, like, that would the scare the shit out of me. That would be a horrible experience, in my opinion. I just feel like I'm already, like, anxious enough as is, like, on just a normal daily basis. I feel like adding, Daniel. like, hallucinations to that, Daniel. you know, hey, you out here? 
would be awful. Daniel! Oh well, he got trapped by a serial killer. Where is he? Um, the physics on the snow is actually not bad. Hm. We have a two-day walk ahead of us. Better get going. Mm, that leads back to the house. Daniel? Where are you? There's no tracks leading this way. All I can personally speak on is grass. Yeah, well, I'm gonna let you know this. If you move to Tennessee, because I think you were talking about that. What are they doing? Um, we have to leave. Not anymore. Dude, what are you doing? I know. <laughs> Where is he? I didn't even see him. I'm surprised you remembered that, TBH. I only remembered it because I was like, oh, cool! It's so quiet. Daniel! He's like, hey, I live there. And you know what's so funny? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do this, but <laughs> if you, if, if, Somebody just asks, like, your girlfriend, like, hey, what time is it? You can find out whether they live on the eastern side or the western side of Tennessee because Tennessee has two time zones in it. <laughs> Which I think is hilarious. <laughs> oh, shit. What the fuck happened here? It's not good. Oh no. No. Oh no no no. There's blood and the bandana. No, please. Please. I'm making a bunch of four year old work friends. Yippee. Daniel? Oh shit. <gasps> I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not crying. Nope. Mm -mm. She's just hurt. It's, she's just hurt. She's still alive. <laughs> She's still alive. She's just hurt. <laughs> she, she just got. She just got a little bit. She just got a little bite. You know. That's it. She's not dead. She's alive. Just got a little munch. Stage one denial. <laughs> Are you trying to convince yourself or us that you're not crying? Both bot. Both. Oh my god. Sigh. <laughs> I knew it. No, I told you no. It's only a matter of time. Please shut up. I'm actually going to pause the stream. Tell me when this scene is over. <laughs> oh my god. Daniel. Do not move. Calm down, okay? Listen. Leave me alone! No! Nah, bro, fucking. <laughs> I hope you crack its neck. You killed my dog! 
<gasps> Fuck. I was kidding. Daniel. I was trying to be silly. It just. It oh just my god. Happened. What happened in the me? Shh. <laughs> you. Stage four depressant. Holy shit. Protect us. I. Eat it. Save your strength. We'll... Is it done? Yes, it's done. Yeah, I think it it's done at least. Nope, it's not done yet. Oh. Oh. Oh no. It's all right. Flora <laughs> came back, and asked if it was done. We said yes, and then the worst part came. <laughs> Bro, eat the mountain lion, the fuck? That's the food right there. Into <laughs> a forced ghost. A forced ghost. Did I say that right? I don't know if I said forced ghost. Cry on it, and it will come back. This isn't Disney, Alex. This is life. And it's strange. <laughs> There's no T in forest. <laughs> okay, there's no V in of bot. <laughs> Here. You should do it. I'm sorry. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> No, that was good. <laughs> oh. Is that it? What a well, convenient time for ads to run. Unless you want to say something. <laughs> I will spit my water. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> such a good puppy. I'll always remember. Running through the snow with me. This is supposed to be sad, and I'm over here laughing. This is how I cope. Now he's gonna become mushrooms. Oh. Never. You're right. RIP! Good girl. <laughs> Sorry. Rest in peace. You won't be forgotten. That sounds rough, buddy. Sean, you think she's up in heaven? With dad? Yeah. <laughs> nah! <laughs> I kind of want to say nah, just to. No. That's bullshit. Dad's okay. in hell. Still. I think that. The rest in shit, bozo. I know, man. But you'll always be with us. In memories. Like Dad. That's all that matters. Yes. I'll never forget her. Okay. We should go. It's getting late. <laughs> One Sean. tapped that mountain lion. I'm sorry I killed the cat. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> if only I could. Oh, wait, that's I so funny. Come on, buddy. I feel like <laughs> this is hilarious because this is supposed to be a really sad bit. <laughs> but all of our coping mechanisms for sad shit is to make jokes. <laughs> so I've just been laughing this whole fucking time. <laughs> Comedy is the best way to heal. Literally. Keep out wolves inside. Oh, that's a that's a reference to Walking Dead. Or at least I, I think. I hate this game. All right, it should be over. Wish we didn't have to go. We're like Spider-Man without any we're of the like powers or dead uncles, so we're just people. Come on. Let's hit the road. They should literally do that. Yeah. Should we leave them off? 
Don't protect the next runaways to stay here. Bye, Lord Snowman. You look after our mushroom. So long, my dudes. We just fucking yap until it doesn't hurt. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that keep out wolves inside. Um, I don't know if that's a reference to The Walking Dead, but um, obviously The Walking Dead has that famous uh, keep out dead inside. Or Wolf Among Us? Maybe? The snowman does not look- did not look after Mushroom, she's fucking dead! True. Dude, you know that shit's exhausting, walking through the snow like that. There's also probably licensed music that plays during this. Frosty rolled real low on that perception check. <laughs> the perception check. <laughs> He's facing away from where the dog died, so... He did roll low. He rolled a nat one for sure. <laughs> License music is just wild. I want to gag. I want to choke. I want you to touch that little dangly thing that's swinging in the back of my throat. <laughs> it's a DM. I didn't tell you to roll. Bro, what the fuck is this stream? Chaotic stream I've ever had. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. Roll for sadness. I'd roll a natural one. Can I can I ask Google to roll me a twenty a D twenty? Roll me a D twenty. Here, roll a D twenty. Uh, stop. I rolled an eight. <laughs> it's <laughs> don't wait when you started re reciting WAP like slam poetry. I actually spit. <laughs> what is <this> room? <laughs> Roll for safety for mushroom. Oh, wait, she's fucking dead. <laughs> Listen, we said not to get attached. Is there supposed to be music during this? I just want to find out. Yes. I can hear it, it's just very quiet because I have my music set really low. How about we roll? Just to roll. Because Kamba. <laughs> Um. There was no Connor stream yesterday, so I'm suffering from Gamba deficiency. Went from mushroom to mulch. Here. We'll do a little Gamba then. Prediction? Yeah. Here. Will. Dolphin. Rye today. Yes, you're a bitch. Oh, that says bish. Bitch. Nah. Um, you're. We made it, Daniel. Uh. It's been a long time you're... since I was here. When was that? You've got you were born. a heart of ice. Oh, shit. Nah. You ain't no bitch. Come here. 
Let me check you out. Claire likes everything super clean. Dad said she got pissed because he let me bring a snowball in the house. This name is not compliant with our content like guidelines. Thing. Will Dolphin cry today? They just don't want me to cry. Will I cry today? Okay, well, they said fuck what you. What are you waiting for? Twitch. Predictions are wild. What if they went on vacation? Or... Something. We'll they already know something. the answer. I'm sorry, we don't want any of. Hello, would you like to talk about our Lord and Savior Hello, Jesus Christ? Sean? Oh my. Is that Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard. Look who's here. After all this time. The ma the grandmother's name is Claire. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well, Claire, Stephen, and their daughter Karen. That ain't what? It's kind of a long story. <coughs> oh, you poor thing. You know he's sick, right? <sighs> yeah, but Okay, inside. Point what if they're also you. racist? Telling them to wash their mouths and Daniel be slinging around the hard fucker too. Everyone is racist. That's a harsh reality. True. Their boomos, they for sure got a little racism in their OG patch notes. Life is strange, more like life is racist. See, they're racist, just not towards Mexican people. They're racist to African Americans for sure. Hey, is it uh, warm enough for you? Oh yeah. Oh, one hundred percent. Feels nice and toasty. I gave Daniel some cough medicine, but you should have taken better care of him. <laughs> he could have been He's worse. Such... You were lucky. Stephen, may I talk to you for a second? We can't let these illegals in our house, Stephen. <laughs> Sorry, I'm allowed to make those jokes, okay? Oh, I am Latina. Shit. Therefore, I'm, so hungry I'm allowed to laugh at myself. I Can I hear what they're saying? Remember that. I think it used to be in the living room. Oh shit. Our grandchildren are right by the big fire. No. Why don't you bring them out to meet them? Bring them in your hand. Come on. Let's 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 ask them what's happening. Then we'll figure something out. Okay? All right, Stephen. By that logic, Dolphin, my entire bloodline almost ended in a German, la German labor camp in Poland. Well, yeah. You all right, honey? You want more tea? Thanks. I'm good. Uh, well. Who puts tea in sure, a mug? Uh, well, that makes sense. You want to talk about... Uh, uh, the police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as suspects in a homicide. And for assault and robbery in a gas station? They just sit down. You see where the babies are. <laughs> now, so do you know where babies you come want us from? to help you, did you hurt that police officer in Seattle? No. Oh, shit. Um, is it fucking bullshit that they're blaming me? I don't know. And seriously... I, I think seriously is like, seriously, you're blaming me. You, like, you don't believe me. 
No. That's fucking bullshit. I never yeah, touched okay, cool. the guy. No, don't, don't get mad. The choices are vague. We only know what we saw in the news. All I know is that he shot dead. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened Ooh, to Oh, shit, father. he pulled but back. He said, don't touch me, bitch. Why did you run away <laughs> if you're innocent? That's what I've been saying. It happened so fast. I saw the cop on the ground. And my dad, and... And I freaked out. Oh, I know. You poor thing. That just made things worse for you and your brother. That's what we've been saying! You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Daniel would end up in Boston. You can't be sure, Sean. They don't have parents. Anyway, uh, well, Karen, I guess. managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. I hate to think what could have happened to both of you. You need to think of long-term solutions now. I tried. I swear. But I can't do everything. Yeah, dude, bro's so, just like 17, 16, whatever. What are your plans? Going out to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. Dad has a family house there. Sean, you can't run away from the law like, like fugitives. I fought the law How and the, the law one. If you're both running from the police. You two are going to stay with us. They're oh, kidnapping Steven. me. Maybe we should... After your mother left, your dad never really wanted us in your life. I can't blame him, but you're still part of our family, and I want to know what happened to his mom. We want to prove it, okay? Oh, really? Uh, uh, He's a child, scared? Alex. <laughs> I ask how old you are. Lord, yes. <laughs> oh, Lordy, Lordy. Scared for you. <clears throat> That's why you'll have to be careful around here. Beaver Creek is small and racist. Nosy. There you go. We can stay. Tied from Serious? cancer. Awesome. Is he wearing princess oh, pajamas? Guess what? There's a huge model train upstairs. Hey, <laughs> you're supposed to be resting, young man. <laughs> yeah, yes he is. How do you feel He's about mountain already. lions, Stu? Anyway, you and Daniel will stay here. At least until Daniel's better. We'll see what happens next. So, I bet you're hungry. Let me fix you something. You know what's funny? She said, let me fix you something, and then I heard... My dad sharpening, is sharpening knives in the kitchen right now, because uh, he's cooking. And so I heard that, and I thought it was her, and I was like, damn, Grandma! <laughs> when I just my dad in the kitchen. <laughs> How do you feel, Super Wolf? <coughs> Way better. It's nice and warm in here. And the food? My grandma's oh, John Wick. Yeah. Oh, crap, it does. Feels good. Feeling better? You look cozy. Yeah. I love that bed. Mm. Thanks, Grandma. Good. Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? Why? No. Sean says that's bullshit. Oh, no! <laughs> Oops. That's not very polite. We always say a prayer at bedtime. No, we don't. Always. My grandmother was like that, and... She always made me say never prayer. Do. Never. That didn't make us go to church. So. Why see? Maybe you're too young to know everything yet. 
but I can't make you pray. Do you say well, prayers before bed? No, I don't. for bed. And no roughhousing in here. No worries. For personal We're reasons. too tired. Good night. Thank you again. Yeah. We'll be quiet. Mainly. Good night, Grandma. To give, like, a very generalized description, I've, I've been through too much in my life to believe anything is up there that's willing to help me in any way, shape, or form. Feels so nice. So I don't pray before bed. bed. Mood! <laughs> bathroom. I hear that. Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. Well, that prayer thing was pretty weird. I really hope we'll be okay. Girl, same. <laughs> I think so. And the more important thing... My I grandmother, though, that. used to... Uh, Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Used to make me pray before bed Not whenever I spent I the night at her house, and I was always like... But it's been okay. And then just Let's fucking didn't say anything. Tomorrow? Maybe find some of her stuff? Why? Why would you want to do that? I just don't know anything about her. Mm. Daniel, I understand. But we need to focus on where we are now. And where yeah, we're Furnace. Mom left us. She made her choice. We gotta make ours. Come with the 12 Celestials for my singing monsters. Oh my god. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I guess. Hey, man. You've been doing so great with your... Well... You know. I was wondering... For some reason, because of my somehow undying optimism, I'm agnostic how do you now. Do it? Works kind of nice. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I'm just straight up atheist. Like, I don't believe in anything. It just happens. If it wasn't a dead religion, I've said this multiple times, if it wasn't a dead religion, I definitely would have followed uh, Greek mythology. Uh, because it, it technically was a religion a long-ass time ago, but uh, not anymore. It's dead. But I would definitely have been shit. Alex, thank you for the one bit. I appreciate it. Wait. Gods are kind of hot. It no, it's not just because of that. It it makes. It's kinda itchy. I'm a logical person, and the myths make logical sense, Sorry. as opposed to just saying, "Oh, one person anyway, or beings created everything." Or rules, being, right? sorry. You um, really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. I just I make know, jokes. <laughs> don't show, don't talk. Just keep that in mind, and everything should be fine. That's why I think uh, polytheistic religions oh, make more sense to me. Because monotheistic are religions that only have one god. Alex, thanks for the nine bits. Did you mean to cheer ten, but then you accidentally only did one, and then you did the other nine? IDK, I'm just gay, me too. <laughs> Dolphin's gay, so she's naturally drawn to ancient Greece, exactly. Guys, don't hate on me, but I'm straight. It's okay. We don't hate on anybody. Is the next Life is Strange going to be homophobic? I don't know if I'd be able to handle that. Well, I don't even know at this point. It's fine. Oh, man. I could sleep all day long in this bed. Oh, my God. Oh, but I'm way too hungry. But you're the... Thank you for the 20 bits, Alex. You're the... Um, I like my, my little gift that I have for the 20 bits. Um, You're the... Oh, my God. You're the gamer boyfriend. That's crazy. You're like every bi girl's dream is the gamer boyfriend. <laughs> I'm not gay, but my girlfriend is. I'm the golden retriever gamer boyfriend. Yeah! Get dressed before you go, dude. Honestly, that's almost Claire cooler. Thinks breakfast is like a job interview. Uh, where, what do I put on? 
Yep. Literally to a to milk grandma for toys. What's a golden retriever boyfriend? Good. It uh you know he like to be spoiled. the vibes um that a golden retriever gives off. That but a person was training his You know Doug right? from up <laughs> That <laughs> The talking dog I just met you and I like you and I love you. My friend used to do a, an impression of Doug. It was really funny. Alex, thanks for the 30 bits. Bro's going ham on the bits. My name isn't Doug, but yes. Oh, there we go, close. I am terminally online. <laughs> All right. I'm allowed to go out now. Is that supposed to be a Naruto poster? No way. I'm just a weeb. Sean! Finally. That red thing in the poster looks like an Among Us bean. Almost done, so come down when you're ready, okay? Does it? Oh, it kind of does! It looks like a... No, actually, you know what? If you... the That black bit on the bottom, if you look at it from afar, it looks like... That looks like an Among Us dude. You have, like, the little backpack. Look at... Like, yeah, like, the... the but it, the but It's the black Among Us guy. Naruto sucks, absolute horse cock. If you skip the filler, I've heard it's not as bad. I've only watched up to like episode 12 or something like No, 20 something. Um, and it's honestly, it's pretty good in my opinion. But you know, everybody's entitled to their own opinions. I'm not going to judge. Remember. Oh my, look who's awake. Good morning. Daniel, mm. breakfast time. Your brother is ready. DBZ is the same way. Just watch Kai and cut out the filter. Filler. Steven, yeah. Your grandson needs to eat now. You can show him the box car later. I love how they're getting along. Mm, what's on the menu this morning? Well, someone told me the buttermilk waffles are back. Mmm. Mmm. Awesome. You boys done playing. We had a express delivery with the passengers. <coughs> the engine broke down. Yep. Has to go straight to the workshop. Good. No trains so in the kitchen. Gundam because hardly any gotcha, filter. Chief. That's why I like um choo -choo! Attack on Titan. <laughs> and my hero. Oh, sugar. He can fix his trains, but not my kitchen. What you know about AOT? I've watched everything. I watched the entirety of Did it. Did I make enough? Everything's okay? It's great. As usual. You're the best cook ever. Looks like you're getting cozy with this new country life, after all. Yeah. It's nice to be far away from everything. Yeah. Feels like what I know about AOT is there. that there is no racism if there are any other races to Unlike the big city. I mean I get it. You're not wrong. <laughs> I like it. It's cool here. Well bless your soul. You'd get along good with our neighbors. We try to lend a hand. She attack on my Titan like till I'm on next door. He lost his wife, and... There was said, one black guy in the show. Yeah, there was only, like, one. And his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. <gasps> cool. Crazy? 
going on back there? Nothing. Oh, and I thought Stephen was a fast eater. Hey, Grandma, I wanted to ask you something about that locked room upstairs. I told you there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? Damn, something smells good. I think my dad's making pork. Daniel, language. Why don't you go explore outside? You sure look like you're getting better. Get some fresh air. I'll wait for Sean, and then we'll go. We won't be loud. Sean. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back. Mom is trapped in the log room! She just has a taxidermy, like, the mom got taxidermied in the locker room. Volume warning. <laughs> that one actually peaked my mic. <laughs> Oh my god. This is a BDSM dungeon! Okay. Can I make the pred you couldn't make earlier? Yeah, 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 yeah. If you want to do it. Maybe you should tell him that it was Karen's room. And maybe you should tell him to watch his mouth. Oh! It's just a room now, Sean. Nothing to see. Why lock it then? It feels like you're hiding. Just slam my knee There's into no my desk. There's no secret. We just want to move on with our lives, Sean. Did the mom die? Like, what, what was happening? So nobody goes in the room, okay? I'm serious. I want to know. Did mom ever contact you? She only talked to dad a few times. I'm going to move my computer and that and might fuck up my capture card. Yes, yeah, she was. I yeah, Sean. I don't really want to talk about this anymore. It's over. Anyway. Daniel gonna Vader them too. You have to respect my but granny I up, Sean. You. Okay. Hey, come on. Chill out. We're not criminals. I didn't mean that, Sean. Maybe you should go check on your brother. There's a shed with some old toys outside. I'll bet Stephen has the key. Danny will freak. Thank you. Prediction started. Will Dolphin cry today? Of course she's a little bit. Hell not, Dolphin's strong. I wonder where this was taken. I don't picture Claire and Steven as world travelers. Where was that picture of you guys on the beach from? We went to Hawaii when Steven retired. Believe it or not. Uh. Hmm. Think I need a handy assistant. Can you hand me the glue? You need a what now? Sure. Hold on. Whoa! Be careful. Sorry, I I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. Let me just. Uh, okay. Sorry. My fault. Your grandmother keeps telling me, but uh, I'm a lazy old man. Hey, uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh. I'm keeping my um, 37k bubbles. Cable, of nah, bro, spend your bubbles. Can I predict in it? No, I can't. So, listen, I've uh, noticed things with Daniel. You know what I'm talking about. I smell Don't something. You? Ooh. Nah, man, I'm gonna hide the secret. Um, 
not really. Of the ocean breeze. What things? Well, I, I'm not sure how to put it. Like some kind of smell. invisible <laughs> I force. I smell right? peach in here. <laughs> I smell uh, a bitch in here. <laughs> yeah. Damn, Damn Grease. Pretend he's got superpowers, but that's it. That's it? Okay. But be careful, Sean. You know, he's still so young. Sure. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Claire has a lot of strong beliefs. She wouldn't understand. She adores Daniel. And just wants both of you to be safe and happy. What I'm trying to say is... 2K in the bank. Maybe you should stay here with us. I know you boys plan to run to Mexico, but... We have a home in Puerto Lobos. Dad wanted to return there. Two Mexican boys out on the run. I just fail at math. That Me too. That won't be a secret in Beaver Creek for long. America is your home. With us. And you have to think about your brother. You know, his future. All that stuff. It's too dangerous for us to stay here. And for you guys too. It's dangerous to be on the road. Do you think your father would have wanted this for his kids? You don't know him. You never even tried to. So don't speak for him. Sorry. You're right, Sean. It was complicated with your mom. With Karen. I know. I... Sorry for yelling at you. Hey, uh... Claire said you had the keys for the tool shed? Oh, uh, sure. <clears throat> Here. You guys enjoy the sun. See, that's a lie, because in Oregon, the sun never came out. And be careful with that shed. It's probably a mess inside. Thanks. Good to oh, there you are, Sean. Got the key? Hey. I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? <laughs> Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally, yeah. Oh, she's such uh, a close... No problem. Thank you so much. Clothes taller. Feel free to start close. tidying your stuff, too. It's good With for the health to keep sauce. a house clean. Of swaz. Daniel can help. Ah, and remember, for your own safety, no phone and no internet. I know, I know, boring rules. Don't worry, Claire. Hey, Daniel. There's work for you. Uh, no. I'm busy. Yeah, busy my ass. Come over here. <laughs> you gotta find me first. Jeez. Man. You know I'm gonna find you. Why is it so dark in this room? Holy fucking shit. Hola. Huh? Well, he's clearly not there. Gotcha. Hmm. When he opened that lock thing, I wish he bonked his head. Nah, bro. I get that he's sick of all this shit, but... Why are we playing this game? Come on. I need help. Oh. 
Hmm. Ah, classic under the bed. Feels so good. I know you're in there. Gotcha. Oh. Come on, catch your butt out. Okay, okay. As always with Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. <sighs> All right, time to take care of that laundry. <sighs> Thanks, Claire. As always with Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. Oh, uh, why Daniel walking like that? Daniel's always walking weird. <clears throat> She wants us to do the laundry, but I'm not getting any prompts over here. I would hide under the bed. That's a classic, honestly. Um, hide in the walls. Have you ever seen any actual fish in there? There's not a trophy wife. True. As always with Claire, Dude, I can't really tell if this is... is cute or bossy. Do I need to go upstairs and get her laundry? Sean, quick! Look at this fish! No. I don't want to. Better not sneak in. They won't like it. <sighs> it's been locked ever since we got here. I kind of don't give a fuck. I'll tidy up the board game. See you tonight, buddy. What is a trophy wife? Um, how do I explain it? Somebody know how to explain a trophy wife in a simple way. It's weird. Sometimes I feel like Whoa, look at all these decorations. That's so cool. Hey, do you think you can fix that? Gee, that's pretty small. Let me try. 
I did it! Hey, check out the sail. So this was mom's ship? I don't know, man. You should break I it guess. again. I tried one of Claire's books yesterday. It's basically a telenovela with white old women. Hey, I want to be in your drawings. Only married because they're hot type B. Yeah. Cool. And it's normally with an old rich man. I'm not moving. Hope I look good. <laughs> Time to take moving. the pen, dude. Hope I look good. Or I'm not hmm. Pretty I'm good. good. Um. But I can add more details if I want. That too, but well, that would be okay. it makes the wife Got a it. gold digger and a tro. I mean, I would say it's pretty much close to the same. I'm no? not moving. Hope I look. Good. I get it. You're not moving. You hope you look good. Shut the fuck up. God, Jesus. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. <laughs> Holy still, you little shit. Hold <laughs> still, you little shit. Guys, I think he's not moving. Paper. Our dirty clothes are in the bathroom. Obviously. Thanks for t finally fucking telling me, bro. Paint me like one of your French girls. Let's go dirty laundry. Speaking of which, right. I have to do Let's laundry. Let's get it over with. One statue of David impression. Oh God. Get why dad never brought us down here. Also, can I How just many say programs does this thing have? I okay. It will do. I have always washed my um colors and whites together and never have I had an issue with that. Never. So I don't get that whole thing. My mom does the whites and the colors separate. Wait, what does it say? Claire can draw pretty damn good. Hmm. Guess it runs in the family. Stefan's book. This is pretty good so far. I love that Steven only has crime and train books. That's cool. Claire dug this up for us. That's such a baller in his suit. Kind of a like me to our camp and this flock won't leave me alone. Like, bitch, get your Pinkie Pie ass away from me. He's standing outside my cabin. How do you have internet? Wonder if Brody noticed his hula girl was missing. Come on, man. I put all your toys in the trash, dude. Oh, really? Of course not. But next Some time you bail on me, home. maybe I will. Sorry. Hey, man. Can you? Oh. 
<laughs> Why am I itchy? It's so weird to be back here again. It's itchy. I'm itchy. Claire and Steven are kind of weird sometimes, but they do care about us. I'm glad there's boiling Daniel. Wish I could. Dude, you're 16. Oh, I was gonna have him fix that frame, but now I think I can't. Shit. I found some randos password. Boiling laundry? Hmm. Done. Time for fresh. Hope I'll never have to hold on to a bar to take a shit. Have you guys ever had to hold on to a bar to take a shit? I haven't. Okay. He said. Burn off some calories. What he said, think? "I hope I never have to hold on to a bar to take a shit." So yeah. I was wondering, have you guys ever had to hold on to a bar to take a shit? How dare you ask oh. that? Yes, I have. <laughs> Man, finally. Feels so good to be outside. Reminds me of the cabin. Right? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Get ready for storage wars. Okay, Daniel's a furry. <gasps> What's wrong? <sighs> Frozen shut. Of course. Sean, look! Ah! Nah, bro, should have let him fall. What? We just got here. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Uh, I didn't see anything either. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Okay, I just fell down into the snow. Dad says I'm kind of clumsy. That T-shirt is wicked. Do we need to talk? Like, we're voice cracking every two seconds because, like, I can't understand anything you're saying when you're talking. Like, your voice is, you know, so raspy, and honestly, it's probably not that raspy. Who's your favorite superhero? Wicked. I love Power, power Bear. bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I have the Mega Power Bear. You should check it out. So cool. I've got the Chibi Power Bear. The talking one. No, no one can, one defeat, can defeat justice. justice. <laughs> Chris, oh God. Look, I, I am so sorry. Are you okay? Uh, Dad. A white I'm man. I'm fine. I promise. Uh, are you sure? Listen, I shouldn't. Do you know them? This kid is it, like Kyle's okay, cousin from South Park. They're cool. Similar. Kill he them. love superheroes. Even Power Bear. Ah, gotcha. This Are guy's gonna be racist too! Are you staying with the Reynolds? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh yeah. I don't know, we haven't found anybody racist yet. Grandparents. Not in uh, this safe. episode. Oh jeez, Chris. <sighs> you don't have any damn shoes on. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> yet. Let's get you inside. <laughs> I uh Yeah. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Oh, and uh if Claire asks, tell her everything is fine. Is it? Is it really? Uh, never mind. See you around. Sure. Why are we so standoffish? Damn. Thanks, guys. See you later. Yes, we will. <sighs> Daniel, 
Did you forget everything about the rules already? Sorry, Sean. Did you want me to let him fall? Really? Yes. I know you only wanted to help. I'm making grilled cheese. Oh, can you make me one? For both of us. And mail it to me? Whatever. I want a grilled cheese. Rules are boring. Yeah. But it'll be worse than boring if we get busted out here. Come on, Daniel. Steven already saw you using your powers. <laughs> I'm a master Fine. griller. I'll be careful. I'll never help anybody again. Okay. Okay, Daniel, back to a conversation we were having 20 minutes ago. That we're hiding out. So no More like an hour ago. No um, but how cool would it be, though, if your girlfriend just so on, happens to live like in the same town as me? The time. I highly doubt it. Because the town I live in is fairly small. <laughs> but... That'd be cool. That would be cool. <laughs> Imagine. Everybody's 8th and ninth streamers <laughs> live in the same town. <laughs> do you want me to, to, to DM you the town name? Do it. Why not? Do you have me on Discord? I don't know if you have me on Discord. How funny would that be? Like, genuinely. I'm in, well, I mean, I'm in Connor's Discord, uh, server. Oh, fuck. That kid never listened. Here. Let me join your server, lol. Do this, and I do this. There. Anyone got a link? You can type exclamation mark Discord. There you go. I should get dressed to go look for Daniel. Uh, where are my clothes? Clothes. Dolphin check DMs. Mm, I might, might not. Form. What the fuck is this form? <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah, no. But I don't I don't live near there. That's like a th 3 hour drive. Dude, move your ass. From where I am. Claire? I want to see Steven. Say Anybody home? Wait! Hold on. Okay, wait. Because one of my favorite... Okay, one of my favorite uh, TikTok creators just sent her, um, her baby horse to the university in that town where your girlfriend lives. So I was going to say it doesn't <laughs> well, looks like I'm Oh my alone. god. Maybe. <laughs> oh, that'd be funny. Oh, right. Sunday morning. Claire and Steven must be at church. Church. Yeah. Where is uh Daniel? Grilled cheese and tomato well, soup go hard. I guess they won't be back for at least two hours. Back by noon for lunch. See you in a bit. Christmas tree's perfect. Good job, kids. Thank you for tidying up a Maybe bit. Maybe I could use Steven's laptop. <gasps> it's been ages since I've had news from the real world. Here, ask her. Ask your girlfriend if she knows a horse by the name of that. And if she does, your girlfriend's like my favorite person now. She's studying to be a pathologist, so unless the horse is dead. Oh, never mind. The horse is not dead. <laughs> Jeez. Steven I can tell you that right now. Us. At least I don't think so. <laughs> no, we haven't gotten an update on him in a while. <laughs> oh, God. She doesn't exclusively work on dead things. Well, 
ask her if you want, but... Seattle Blast and Shooting, an Unresolved Mystery. Officer Tanaka holds a press conference on Seattle Incident. SPD still considering every lead, including terror attack and gang fight. Gang fight. More questions and answers in Seattle Incident as friends and neighbors mourn the loss of local mechanic. I'll visit Brody's blog. Why not? Well, Brody, if we ever make it home... Jesus Christ. Wherever that is... Uh, he'll be much, much welcome. This dispatch from off the road uh, is a tribute to a couple of new young friends I made on a recent adventure that I've yet to transcribe or even fully process yet. I'll leave the details vague to protect the innocent, because believe me, they're not guilty, but let me digress. The best part of being a professional traveler, meaning I sometimes make gas money off these dispatches, is the people you meet in on the proverbial road. Of course, the worst part about being a professional traveler is the people you meet on the actual road. I've been uh, too lucky for a variety of reasons, though I've had moments of pants-shitting fear from the highway patrol following me at night to that weird motherfucker I picked up in Iowa who wouldn't leave the car. Read that awful account here. Ultimately, I approach strangers as potential friends, if not allies. I'm a naive and stupid I am that naive and stupid that the universe feels sorry for me to let me skate by as I help people on instinct rather than objectivity. First thought, best thought. I hear my ex-brother, his choice, telling me years ago that you read all this correct Kerouac crap about life on the road, but you can't even change a tire, asshole. He was right, so I learned how to change a tire. I'm not good at it, but so I have also have towing insurance end of dilemma however i can't always give my own version of roadside assistance including to my young compañeros who needed it the most i wish i could have done more for them even maybe even join their quest because it's uh it's a more important journey than mine instead of pushing a rock up a hill i could have helped m them move mountains out of the way if we were hanging out again i would ask them to forgive me for not coming along to offer whatever help i could then again i'm kind of clum a clumsy dork and I could have fucked shit up by trying to play savior. Ah, the paralysis of analysis. My suspicion is that they really didn't need me in the end, just each other. Is tomato paste tomato soup? No. It's not. So I continue to weave this highway and roadside tapestry, always paying it forward. Call it guilty if you want, I'm still that geeky. Sincere kid who looked up to anyone who wanted to change the world for good, who wanted to move mountains for others. I always used wanted to be carbound uh lois lane a roaming reporter getting in the face of this corrupt matrix sure my adult cynic uh knows the system is rigged uh that we're screwed on and that justice is often just a joke but when i saw the faces of my wandering friends who went through hell and are still there for all i know smiling with childlike gratitude at most of my trivial gifts i feel ashamed and saddened there are times when i encounter a little soul lost and they flash that wide grateful Wide-eyed, grateful, frightened stare, and you feel like your heart break. You feel your heart break into a million pieces. Now I think of all those children out there, alone at night, in the night, on the precipice, the razor's edge of America and beyond. I want to, uh, wanting the only most basic of life's needs, like food and parents. It makes me cry and sick at once. Then I rage, rage against the dying of the light that, uh and vow to do my part that's the benefit of an activist on wheels i always like to think of myself as moving forward um like a friendly shark otherwise we don't eat we don't survive now i find myself thinking of the past wondering if i gave the best advice to those in need and uh if i even helped those children on the Amer of the american night by leaving them on their own um, then I realize that I'm the only one who's actually lost out here. My friends climbing the hills know exactly where they're going, and I know they're going to make it home. I'd like to plan a visit. Prody makes everything interesting. <laughs> Even the weirdest What if, stuff. when I move my ass out there, what I'm hearing is the eighth time best podcast can happen? <laughs> yeah, right? Also, I asked and she doesn't know the horse. Damn, okay. That's fine anyways. Uh, the sky, and this is the most perfect blue cliche, as I pull my, uh, wary glass, gas beast off the winding Highway 5 into the tiny main vein of Rockville Springs, Wyoming, um, and it, I've actually been to Wyoming, which is funny, and it's at its community height, Pop 4, 472. This is a stark barren land before time, 
like any other sleepy town born from local mine chefs that fed the community along with the robber barons who own the oil. The citizens suffer their fair share of tragedy over the decades, but managed to retain a healthy main street with a few thriving shops and services. By the end of the oil-starved 1970s, the once sleepy town was in a coma after the last drops of precious earth blood had been mined. The company quietly closed shop and left town with and populace to their own devices, which means most people... Uh, most people packed up and closed shop and left forever, which brings me to Rocky what, Rockville Springs, Wyoming, population 51. Inhabited by ghosts who stay behind to haunt what was left of the town, discarded their white sheets and are nar now stark naked. There was an, there was always an eccentric Lynchian, Lin yeah, Lynchian aura over Rock uh, Rockville Springs as demonstrated by their very own nudist community, who have been very quietly amassing ever since the 1950s after local oil first gushed from the earth. The town wasn't as religious or conservative, of, conservative as, as others in the repressive area, so the thought of nude volleyball didn't cause a legal scandal. How could it when the city's own mayor seemed seen or unseen sunbathing in his birthday suit? So therefore, nobody gave a rat's ass even though they could see everybody's ass. In the majority of the town, uh, when the majority of the town was abandoned, the nudist community saw this as a chance to pursue their angle of their lifelong dream, a naked public sphere free of moral judgment. Rats? I thought they were wolves. Uh, but back in the future, i.e. 2016, the leftover, forgotten, and unclothed residents of Rock Rockville Springs have come under some misjudged public and political attacks for their own natural lifestyle. Uh, thanks to smug media reports, curious visitors can now... Uh, drive th ooh, through the depleted Main Street, not to get a cup of the damn fine pie and coffee at Raw Cafe, tell him Brody sent you, but to giggle and take selfies with the new townspeople as their background props. It's rather gross to witness as I did my brief drive through report, yet there's no doubt some members of the town welcome the tourists because they spend money. There's that old expression, there's no such thing as bad publicity. Ironically, I'd heard about Rockville Springs in my travels and vowed to stop there someday, if only to satisfy my need to see a 56-year-old six, naked man change the oil in my car. <laughs> then I had a boring epiphany. How do you talk to a naked person? I found out you just talk. You don't forget about... Uh, that they're not wearing any clothes, but you actually end up being embarrassed that you are. The people I saw and chatted up didn't even have any particularly unique insights about the the world or geopolitics. As the mechanic told me, I give them taxes, don't ask me to vote for the bastards too. Ironically, some tended to be quite conservative. They just wanted to not pay taxes without clothes. Uh, others seem to stay out of sight with the crowds around, which makes the recent media circus more insulting, since the tone of the reports is always con condescending. Ooh, look at the funny people with sagging flesh, cooking eggs, and jogging down the road. And full disclosure, I admit that the f that the former Brody would have been one of these same judge same judgmental assholes. Glad I'm not him anymore. Okay, take a breath, my dude. I'm not saying this mild condemnation is great uh, is a great threat to liberty. We obviously have worse going on in the country. Mm. But it's always a revealing microcosm of how we treat our to each other in uh, in all our naked hypocrisy. H was oddly specific. Yeah, fifty six. Holy shit! Who are these assholes? That's what happens when you let like, cockroaches in the kitchen. Speech. I've got a thirty eight bullet with you and your brother's name on it. Sleep tight, kids. I just reported you for death threats. Go back to China, dog eat it. Holy shit. Hi, Mr. Diaz. I'm a reporter for Seattle Underground, and if you would be interested in an off-record interview to air your side of the story, uh, please message me at your convenience. Thank you for your help. Sean and Daniel are not killers. You can contact me if you need to. They don't need... They don't deserve exposure. Wow. Lila seems to be having a hard time. Well, injustice are not always the same. Never Gloria seen Steinem. this salty. Seattle protests, SPD to hold awareness, workshops on racial bias, cool story bros, guess what, too fucking late. Hey, wanna hang out at the park this afternoon? Sorry, dude, not today. I should really call Lila to check on her. Hmm. Okay, where's the phone? I gotta go do some adulting, sadly. I'll be back later if you're still on. Alright, see ya, bot. Be good, oh, everyone. <laughs> Don't be racist. Let's get this Brack back home now. Wasn't planning on it. <laughs> 
Why does Daniel never listen? Maybe I'm too soft with him. Oh, Daniel, shit! What's going on here? Sean! Wait! Don't freak out! I can't explain! Let me tell him. Sean, I know it sounds crazy, but I have a superpower. You saw me yesterday. I know you did. I was flying. I can move things. Objects. With my mind. Oh. A superpower. Really? Yes. Great. And you don't realize what that implies? Everyone can see you from the outside. You could get in real trouble. This is dangerous. Do you understand? Yes. We hear you. We promise to be careful. This is just our secret, okay? Nobody can find out I'm the real Captain Spirit. And nobody will. Ever. Now you're an official member of the Spirit Squad. If you betray us, I'll disintegrate you. <laughs> nah, just kidding. Oh yeah, we need a... Team Signal. Totally. I'm gonna be Super Wolf. What's your super name, Sean? I don't know. Something cool like El Diez Blo Loco. Mm, sounds like a super villain's name, but okay. Okay, guys, I think we're ready to roll. Uh, excuse me. Who are you? I'm Sean. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, man. You're here for Daniel. Hey, let's make it official. I'm Charles Erickson. Nice to meet you. Hope Charles. you know that Daniel and Chris are a dangerous team. We better watch out, or they're gonna take over the world. Yeah, they share a lot of things, as thick as thieves. Can we go get the Christmas tree now? We're both ready to fly. Yes, yes, yes. The, the team has been waiting too long. Hey, you should come along too. There's nothing going on Can we on kill the here. kid? <laughs> no. Yes. Can't wait to see all the decorations. And Sean, we could buy Christmas presents for Grandma and Grandpa. Um, okay, sure. <laughs> Let I'll me have any fun. Really? <laughs> yeah. Cool. yeah, I just wish Chris and Daniel were excited about going. Okay, team, uh, give me a time out to clean up the back seat. I'll honk when I'm done. Ooh, uh... Can I use the bathroom? Of course. Oh, you'll see my comic books. I'm glad you're coming too. Hey, you want to see my toys? Oh, score! The new hot dog man? Since you're a new member of the team, you have to know everybody. These are Captain Spear's friends and his enemies. Dude, that's pretty cool. Can you guess who are the good guys and the villains? Let's see. I swear to God, if the fucking black bear is a villain, I'm, 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 I don't even know. Let's find out. Look closely. Say you're a villain. I'll say you're a villain. I know you're going to be a hero. Let's say you're a hero. Careful. It may be tricky. Let's say you're a hero. A villain? Interesting. Are they all villains except for the bear? Okay. Is pirate bear is warrior hero? And pirate bear a hero? You sure. Oh. No, I'm gonna put pirate bear in the villains. I'll put warrior in the villains. And then I'll put, I'll do what I did before, insectoid. Actually, I'll put warrior in the heroes. Hmm. These guys are okay. villains. Okay. Okay. How did I do? You're not a very good observer. Okay. Let me introduce them to you. This is Team Spirit. Okay. The good guys. There's the forest warrior, power bear, more T-Rex, and sky pirate. So... 
Who are the bad guys? That's Noctarius and the Shark Stinger. There's also Snowmancer, but he's out in the garden. But they're all working for Mantroid, who's the real supervillain. So, where is he? Hiding out on his evil planet, waiting for me. But Captain Spirit and Super Wolf will make sure he doesn't hurt anyone. <laughs> yeah, strength in numbers. Sounds like Mantroid is in trouble. Just wait until he sees what Captain Spirit can do now. Yeah, about that. Aren't you afraid? Maybe it's not a good idea to disclose all your powers like this. That Mantroid guy could be watching you, you know? Even better. So he'll know he better stay away from us. Anyway, you shouldn't let anyone know about this. Not even your father. I'm definitely not telling Dad. I don't want to freak him out. He's worried about other stuff anyway. What's he worried about? Chris? Oh, I burned my soup! None of my business, but... Are you and your dad okay? Oh, no. Uh, what do you mean? How? Oh, fuck. Know. Um, Claire seems to... Be worried about you guys. Claire's always worried. Claire needs to learn how to mind her own totally. fucking business. He's just he a drug has addict. A hard time being on his own. That's all. Well, I can understand that, but I hope you know you're not alone. Thanks, Sean. But I don't feel scared anymore. I have the power. And I have Daniel. Sorry, the water eater is still broken. There's the signal. Come on, Daniel. Hey! The water eater? Pro tip, don't go in there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, squad. Let's roll. You need my jacket? I don't want you catching another cold. No, I'm good. Thanks. And don't be waving your arms around when I'm driving, okay? <laughs> yeah. Um, remember, Daniel, don't mess around. All right. Jeez. I told off the pink bitch. What did you say? Dude, it's so dangerous to drive in the snow. What the fuck? Why are you guys driving in the snow? <clears throat> Alright, give me a second. I'll be right back. I'm gonna make myself some food real quick. Actually, you know what? Let me throw up my be right back sign. Thing. Be right back.
I overturned. I thought that was going to take longer than I thought than it did. Uh, no. Switch back. Anyways, Alex, what did you say to the pink-haired person? Got some food. It's delicious. Damn, that's good. Okay, buddy. You ready? Yeah. Hey! You guys go ahead and we'll come back to meet you, okay? Brothers meeting. Sure. But... Don't get lost. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? I can't believe it. How many times do we have to keep going over the rules? You made your own impulse threw up. <laughs> I know. But Chris thinks he can do all this cool stuff. I wish he could. He reminds me of Noah. I just miss having friends, Sean. Listen, I understand, but we have to be extra careful out here. We can't let people see you. You know the rules. Yes, I know the rules. Spicy. But I'm careful. I only do things when it's me and Chris. Nobody sees us. Yeah, nobody but me. What if it was Chris's dad? Or grandma? Or a cop? Or... Okay, okay. I get it. But yeah, I'm this careful. Is good. That's not enough. You have to be extra, extra careful. All right. I swear I will. Deal. I'm counting on you, Ananu. Can I go see Chris now? Yeah, let's go. But don't forget what I said. Wow. So many trees. Ugh. They look like giant cocoons. Creepy. Damn, Alex. You tell him. You coming, Sean? Don't worry. I'll be around. Hey, what's up? Uh, nothing. I'll tell you later. So, what do we do? We have to figure it out. All right. Everything all right? All good. Quiet morning as usual. Good. Tell me if you need anything, okay? Sure. Not the wooden bears. We only sell handmade local products. So come take a look. All good. Beautiful morning. Dangerous mission. We'll have to tame the one we want. What about this one? Dad pushed every year to get a plastic tree. <laughs> but we never surrendered. You're right. We need a strong tree to protect our base from evil. Sorry, man. I prefer my pine trees alive. Please. Behold, the giant condom machine. <laughs> the giant Let's condom go. machine. Jeez. Daniel Snowman wasn't that creepy after all. Ooh, this one is cool. I agree. Adding it to the top tree. Let's look at another one. 
Oh shit, this is it smells smells like a cactus. A snow cactus. Okay. Dear Santa, we've been good kids this year. Please explain this hot mess. This is so My girl G. Seattle. No. Don't know if I can get used to it. Is that a yo-yo? Daniel had one back home. Betty loved this. I I know it sucks, but Daniel deserves it too. Right? Hmm. Quiet. The best minute. Christmas wreaths are here. Decorate your front doors with something true. Hi. This is a nice collection. <laughs> Why, thank you. I make them all myself. Of course you do. Whoa. Must be a lot of work. <laughs> Definitely too much for the money they get me, yes. Oh, I just ate a chunk of the garlic. How come? It's well, delicious. Well, people certainly don't buy as much handmade Christmas decorations as they used to. The mall has ruined every single shop in town. Can't do anything about it, and people seem surprised unemployment is going through the roof. I know. It sucks. But we can't do anything about it. Right? I like to think there's always a solution, however frustrating that thought can be. Anyway, you've got better things to do than listening to an old lady ranting about capitalism, right? That's cool. Don't worry. Well, thanks for hearing me out anyway. You have a nice day. Did I lock the shop yesterday? Hmm. So my dad made this Nicaragua Seems like food. Charles is waiting for us. But we should get going. He put so much. Found what you were looking for, city boy? <gasps> um. Yeah. No. Oh no. Okay. Something for Hi. my little brother. You bought your brother something out here. Damn. Poor kid. Sorry. I'm just a grumpy old gal. That ain't a lesbian. Me and my friends have been crashing here for the week. Nobody gives a shit about us. No shit? Yeah, I can tell you're not from around here. <laughs> no. No way. Dolphin, show us the just sword. I didn't see it on stream. <laughs> Give me a second. Let me go get it. It's not in your- it, it is in my room, it's just- I gotta- It's by my closet, and my desk is on the other side of my room. Um... Hello. Um, this is the sword. That's the sheath. And then, um, this is the sword itself. It's got this, like, little design on it. And then, I like this part. I don't know if you can see it, though. It's got skulls on it. Um, yeah. That's pretty much it. It's got, like, that. And then this is the hilt of it. It's nice. I like it. I think it's cool. Um, I'm just gonna put it in this middle right there. All right, cool. Um, music video. I like the cracks. It's like my OC sword. Yeah, I like the cracks too. Here for the holidays. Ah, you got family. My grandparents. <laughs> Gotta love the grandparents. What about you and your friends? Road trips? Uh, <laughs> not really. We kind of hop from place to place, hunting for 
little jobs. And... Must be a long ride. That's okay. We hop on trains. Gives us time to rest. Man, that sounds wicked. <laughs> you have no idea. It's free and so fucking fun. Well, unless you get caught or fall, but we've been lucky so far. That's the best. Nobody tells us what to do. No corporation owns us. <sighs> and you get to see so many cool places. Exactly. Next stop is Humboldt County, California. <laughs> Stoner break. Not even close. We actually got work over there. Sean, what are you doing? We've hit the tree with Chris. It's all crooked like an old witch. Oh, hi. Who are you? Ooh, your hair looks so cool. Is it a wig? Uh, well, what do you think? Hmm, I don't know. But it's really cool. He's like a mullet, but not I'm really. Daniel. What's your name? Hi, Daniel. I'm Cassidy. I dig your superhero outfit. I'm on a secret mission with my friend. It's very dangerous. I can tell. I hope you get your mission accomplished. <laughs> and what's your name? Oh, uh, Sean. I... I thought I told you. <laughs> now you did. Sorry, you went through some shit with the guys. How much you make? You ready? Hello, pups. Oh, is that your doggy? So cool. Yeah, he's been through a lot. Like most of us. So we adopted him. Puppy! Oh, he stinks. There's a new Yeah, you yeah. stink and you like it, huh? <laughs> He's not the only one. Have you checked your hair? I think it just twitched. You should keep your distance, dude. Mushroom too. She looks really cool, I think. See? He knows I'm clean. You're the nasty one. Yeah, you always go for those suburban boys. <laughs> Are you kidding? You want to talk about your scoreboard, Hotshot? Hey, no worries. Come on, let's bail. It was nice meeting you, Sean and Daniel. Stay out of trouble, Goodbye. kids. Hope we see you on the rails someday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> see you around. Ew, Fortnite ends. was so cute. I miss Mushroom. I miss her too. Hey, excuse me. Dogs have to be on a leash around here. Too many strays. Sorry, dude. We don't do leashes. Well, the city does. An unleashed dog is liable to a fine, so... Uh, you're gonna fine our dog? Well, that's not very nice. Loitering is illegal, too. And you don't live here, right? Right? Calm down, sweetie. We're allowed to visit the Christmas market. A dog's not gonna eat you. Look at him. You better watch your mouth. He's just a little you guy. You punks are always causing trouble. This is a nice town, okay? Jeez. Oh, Someone needs to get laid. <laughs> He's out of pills. That's it. I'm calling the cops. Oh, God. He's gonna call the cops on us, Finn. <gasps> I love that name. Oh, Sorry. We're leaving this shithole anyway. You guys don't even have a Santa, for Christ's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. Fucking parasites. Why did they fight? I don't get why he. Because he's like racist, that. probably. We should kick his ass, Sean. I mean, if it's just a prank. See the snow on that booth? Yeah. What about it? Maybe this guy needs a shower. You know? To cool him down. <laughs> You're right. Hold on. Careful. Careful. <laughs> this will teach them. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <sighs> They're pretty. 
I thought that was a butt. How did he not see the kid move his hand? I don't know, man. Hey, you guys ready to go? <laughs> yeah. All done. Cool. <laughs> Hop in. Are you having too much fun Grandpa back there? Grandpa can't see shit. That's what I thought. You know what's so funny, though? Is the fact that in some towns, depending on how close you are to the mountains, it does genuinely look like this in Oregon. It is fucking gorgeous over there. Like, I don't know exactly where they are. I mean, they're in Beaver Creek, but I don't know if that's an actual town. Um, or where it is. I haven't heard of it. But it is genuinely this pretty in Oregon. <sighs> Looks like Daniel found a new brother. <laughs> no kidding. He dumped me like a rock. I'm glad you two came along. It's great that Chris found a new friend out here. It looks like you did too. What's her name? Um, Cassidy. It's in Clackamas County. Do you like her? I want to see. She just wanted some money. Don't we all? Yeah, so it's by Portland. You're too quick. It's actually not too far from where I live. It's good for me to get out, too. We've had a rough time over the past couple of years. Let me see directions. My wife, Emily, she died two years ago. It's about an hour away Obviously, from where I used to live. It was tough on Chris. Shit. Uh, I'm sorry, man. Thanks. It's been a struggle. Especially trying to be a good dad. Do you have some kind of problems? I'm just not the man I was. He seems like an alcoholic. Mm. I shouldn't have even brought this up, you know, just forget it. No worries. Didn't mean to make you feel bad. We all have our ups and downs, right? That's how life works. Your grandparents sure did have their share of downs, too. But they're always there for us. For Chris. They seem like good people. Yeah, my... My mom left my dad a long time ago. She... Never came back. She broke all ties with her parents, too. <sighs> Sorry for bringing that up. It's okay. I hope they don't stress out because we haven't come back. Uh, yeah, we should get you two home. Uh, don't keep them waiting. Yeah. I don't know if they're divorced. I think she hey, just left him. Uh, Want to set up that Christmas tree? Yeah. Well, I'll get there before you with my dad. <laughs> no way you can beat Kathy. You're it. <laughs> See you later, Super Wolf. Hello? He's gotta get hit, yeah, right? That's what I was thinking. Hello? Claire? Dude, they turn the corner and there's just Steven? a cop. Looks like Grandma and Grandpa haven't come back from church yet. Well, at least they won't yell My at us for going body. out. That was so cool to spend time with Chris at the market. Did you know Chris's mom was an artist? I didn't. How so? She drew comics. You should see her drawings. They're so cool. Just like yours. Thanks, dude. 
Hey. Uh. What? What is it? Sean? I want to go check on the room. Upstairs. I know it's mom's. Please. <laughs> oh, autocorrect. You won't give up on that, right? It's just... I really want to know what's inside. What kind of stuff she has. Chris has tons of things that belong to his mom. And I have nothing. Come on, Sean. You don't even have to come with me. If you don't want to. <sighs> Fuck it. I'll come with you. So you don't make a mess and get us caught. Is still locked. Hmm. I just bitch, cry about look it, at man. why they locked the room. Can't you open it with your fucking powers? <sighs> What's the big deal? We'll find a way to open it. Or I could just blow this stupid door up with my power. That looks super easy. And can't you just yeah, unlock I it? Could do that with a hammer. Let's try and find the key instead. All right. It's gonna be in their yeah grandparents' room. I'm just gonna clean up real quick. Grandpa's cat. So there's a nightstand there. I'm gonna guess this is the grand. Uh... Oh shit, there's a bunch of shit here. Baby picture. <laughs> Who knew this sweet little muffin would turn into such a brat? <laughs> Still super cute though. <laughs> Love the outfits, guys. Man. Oh my god, that's Karen a dog! collecting trinkets. <laughs> she used to say they were just useless dust traps. <gasps> oh! Yeah, no. You're in no the game! <laughs> Yo, it's me! <laughs> Locked drawer. Maybe... Key to Karen's room is inside. Shit. These are Christmas presents? Let's not tell Daniel. <laughs> or he'd freak. Clothes. Old stuff. <sighs> Definitely no hidden key. <sighs> okay, Steven. Where do you hide this key? I don't really see Steven listening to old school pop rock music. There's dentures. <sighs> we clearly don't share politics, but at least Steven doesn't preach. Exceptionalism? Yeah. With the dentures. Not much to see in here. Come on, little key. Don't be shy. It's a keychain. <laughs> How much more Irish can you be? There's a bibble. <laughs> One hell of a bedtime story. There's some Didn't pills. know Claire had sleep troubles. And there's a key. Definitely not the one. Way too small. But this one probably goes but to this. Let's see what it opens. Whoa. I'm just looking for a key, not the crown jewels. <laughs> drawer full of dildos. Ew. Are these? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not sure if it's. I don't know why I thought that. Shoot. But still, no key here. Is it in the sewing basket? Sharp objects. <laughs> Bit like Claire. Hmm. Well, there's not a key in here, then. Hmm. Ah. Uh, okay, Daniel. Uh, think hard. What was she wearing? Jeez. Uh, I think it was that weird uh, sweater 
something. Dude, you rock. So that might be downstairs. Oh, I gotta find a way to open that door. Oh, then it's gonna be in the closet. But Daniel's gonna keep ranting about it. Old box. <laughs> the uniform. Oh, you used to be in the fire department. Small town hero starter pack. Oh, shit. Would be cool to ask Steven about his firefighting career. He must have Karen's smile on this picture. Kind of reminds me of Daniel's. Say Brillo. That would have been really useful when we lived in the woods. Come on. Where is this? Could it be in here? Clothes. Old stuff. <sighs> Definitely no hidden key. Then where the fuck is the cardigan? It's not in here, is it? Oh, is it in here? <laughs> this whole house no. is pretty much a huge washing machine. The cardigan isn't in there. It'd have to be in the room, like their room. That the door was closing by itself. It scared me. This shit. These are yeah. um Oh, where the fuck is this cardigan? Oh fuck it. Oh, fuck. Can't find that stupid key. Oh, just go for it. Yes. And don't Blow apart the whole house. <laughs> really? Wow. There's not that much left. Where do you think they put the rest of her stuff? Claire and Steven must have thrown a lot of it away. The rest, it, they want to forget anything related to Karen. <laughs> Why did relate. she leave? The rest is probably packed in these boxes. It's like she almost never used those. I think I remember that one. Karen showed it to me once. You... Hey, Daniel. Check this out. His name is Ulysses. Like... the hero? I guess. So cool. They looked happy. So cool. These pictures are so... random. Is that an amethyst? <sighs> she was into new age bullshit. I have an amethyst. Yeah, you finally left forever. I hear the green choir singing Coward. in the forest and the ancient gray wrapping me in their wood spell, their song, the roots like fuses that explode in reverse. When I hide in my heart hearing that sound that makes me feel older than the forest, older than you, but younger than the crying river at my feet. If I slid into the soil with the voices muffle, like my face in the pillow so nobody knows I'm there, I could sneak in through the wormholes that would only lead down. So over the treetops, over the river, I feel myself leaving forever. That poem didn't even have a good, like, rhythm to it. Man, 
That pen pal sure loved you listening so to her own voice. You so letter. I thought you might have forgot your pen pal. It's so boring out here, and your letters are the best thing ever. You were saying you get very lonely too sometimes up there in Beaver Creek, and I'm so glad we found each other. It's funny, not, that I have this big family, and I'm so jealous of you be for being an only child. You get the whole house to yourself like a queen. I told you before how stupid my brother Keaton is. Such an immature boy. How my stupid brother Keaton is such an immature boy, even though he's the oldest of all my siblings. He thinks he's so cool now just because he has a driver's license. Whatever. Just wait till we can drive, then we can finally visit each other. I hear my dad yelling about something, so I gotta bail before he gets me. Please write back soon, and I'll write as soon as you do your favorite pen pal, Emma. I miss you. Guess the no phone rule wasn't such a thing back then. <sighs> Read a lot of these in the 10th grade. <sighs> Yawn. Hope you enjoyed your trips. So you didn't bail on us for nothing. <sighs> I don't recognize any of these games. This playlist is boring as hell. <laughs> Oh, you were a friend of my mommy's? I hope she took good care of you. I miss my skateboard and going to the park. I think I saw a moon eclipse once before Daniel was born. Never been a big fan of hiking. She take you with her but here I can't like to take pictures of strangers when we walk down the streets. I wonder my mom loved it so much. All right, there's a letter here. Why would Claire lock these up in here? Is that for mom? Huh? Let me see. Daniel. Come on. What's it say? Read it. Seriously, stop. Here, how about this? I've heard the news about Seattle. Please help my boys if they come to you. Oh, shit. What? Oh, Why she wrote to them. Fuck. You can reach me at, at this address. It's a P.O. box I use sometimes. What's a P.O. box? Well, a cop out. In this case, I beg you, please help my sons. Oh, yeah, right. Total bullshit. What do you mean? She cares about us. Well, I don't. Maybe she changed her mind. We could try and contact her. You don't even know her, okay? Don't get any wrong ideas. We should just stick to our plan. For now. Can I read it again? Yeah. Then we gotta go. My goodness. Oh, what happened? <gasps> oh, shit. shit. Excuse me. What are you both doing in here? Except visibly. Ransacking our house while we're at church? We wanted answers. We were just looking for answers. Uh, and, uh. Were they really worth breaking my door open? Claire, please, calm down. No, Stephen. They went way out of line here. We specifically told you to stay out of I this room. I have the right to see my mom's room. This isn't her room anymore. There's nothing to see in here. It's time you learn to respect some rules. Actually, we did find something. Yeah, we found a new letter from my mom. She said she wants to see us. What? You didn't even tell us! <laughs> What's your 4K HD She's not my daughter anymore. Or your mother. She burned all those bridges. One letter doesn't change what she did to me. All of us. She is not welcome back. You bitch! It's been eight years. Maybe it's time to move on. Don't you dare lecture me, Sean. 
You don't know anything about how I feel. I can't hear that. Listen, Sean. I know life has been tough on you the past month. Bless your souls. And, and we put up with a lot of things, even blasphemy. But that breaking our door to sneak into the room, well, that shows you don't respect us. Then you act like I'm the bad guy after what we've done for you. I knew something like this might happen. Maybe you two staying here wasn't such a good idea. She is racist. Ma'am, I think I see why Mom left now. She couldn't put up with your stupid rules anymore. Oh, so that's what you think. Then let me tell you something. Huh? <gasps> Steven! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Get this goddamn thing off me. Steven, no! Hold on, honey, we'll get it off! No! Stop! Oh, my legs! When she ran killer, put her in an oven. <clears throat> Do it, Daniel! Now! Do what? What's going on? She's gonna look at him and go, oh, Sorcerer! What, what are you doing, Daniel? Witchcraft? He's a witch. Oh, my baby, Stephen, are you okay? No, I am. Thanks to Daniel. You were right, Claire. I should have fixed that cupboard months ago. I guess my laziness will get me someday. What in the name of God was that all about? That's impossible. What are you, Daniel? Claire. Listen, they saved me, Claire. That's all that matters. Maybe it was a miracle. Thank you, Lord. Shit. It's the sheriff. Shit. We gotta run. Sean, I didn't. We didn't call them. I know, Grandma. Sean, what are we gonna do? Go hide in the garage. No. No. No way. If the police searches the house, that makes the two of you accomplices. Get your bags and go out the back door. We'll distract him. Really? Yes. Now, get the hell out of here. I know you're in here. Your father's in the driveway. <laughs> so sorry for everything. I wish we could have helped you more. I wish you could stay here with us. Watch out for your brother, Sean. Yes. Be careful. We'll see you as soon as we can, okay? Thanks for helping us. Both of you. Oh, we love you. Now hurry up. Daniel, wait for me when I go up. Move your ass, bro. Oh, shit. This way. Wait, uh, did you cover someone? Shh. 
shit. Would you stay in there? I don't know. <clears throat> Man, Chris must be so mad at me. I could tell he was pissed when he saw I had the power. You get over it. You saved his life. He, he thinks I'm a liar now. He's a smart kid. Could have kid. ran, and the cop wouldn't have seen you. He's not gonna stay, Matt. You guys are the spirit squad, right? I hope so, Sean. I'm tired of running away. Why does my power always bring trouble? You don't have to use your power if you don't want to. But I'm good with it. And I'm the only one who can do these things. I know, but Daniel, you need to be careful and listen to your brother. You think we'll see Grandma and Grandpa again? I don't know. So many notifications. We'll see. Where are we gonna go now? See... See Mom? No way, man. We don't need her, okay? But... She said she wanted to find us. We stick to the plan. We go to Puerto Lobos. That's where we belong. No one will tell us what to do. We can be whoever we want. You think? I don't know. Trust me, man. From now on, we make our own rules. Look, I even got you a present. Merry Christmas, Enano. For real? But it's in two weeks. Who cares? Dates are boring. Here. <laughs> nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. A yo-yo? <laughs> Probably won't. Awesome. To find them, to get a reward for finding them. Probably. Early Christmas is the best. Hey. I got something for you two. I wanted to finish it, but... We're doing it now, so... So cool. I hear hey. a train. Listen. There's a ride. Come on. All aboard. Were the grandparents racist? No. <clears throat> no, they were fine, but the cops did come to check and see if we were at the house, so we had to run away. Now we're train hopping. I'm guessing this is the end of chapter three, uh, two. We'll do chapter three today, too. Um... 
since I can still go for another bit. Uh, actually, let me see how long chapter three is. Just so I can know. Yeah, it's about two hours and 30 minutes, so. To be continued right now. <laughs> All right. No one prayed. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's 50-50 on the Steven thing. You threw a snowball at Mushroom. You let Daniel kill the cougar. You helped with extra chores. You reminded Daniel of the rules after he saved Chris. Um... Oh, that's where the phone is. Well, shit. I didn't gain Chris's trust. I could have drawn for Chris, though. Chris can get hit by the car? I knew it. <clears throat> cool. Well, we're on a train now. This is it? Yeah. It looks like a nettle field. And it's... Why would you take Daniel there? Why would you take... Why was... Why is Daniel... Why? Why? <laughs> no. Oh my god. Yeah. Your stinky feet will cover the smell. Shut up. They don't. It's huge! Come on. I'll show you around. I just broke my chain. Hmm. I broke my chain. Hold on. Can I fix this? I'm gonna take a chair fixing break. All right, that's fine. Next episode, the weed farm.
I find that the choices in this game aren't as hard as um, Life Once is Strange upon a time, one. In a wild, wild world. Can't skip this. Shit. There were two wolf brothers Never mind. living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together. Apologies. Seems less brutal than The Walking Dead. Yeah. Just took their dad away. Forever. So now the brothers were alone. And they had to find a new home. We have to watch this every time. That's when the big brother discovered that the little yeah, I can't one click any buttons. was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. And then they worked together to learn how to use his power and to follow the rules for them. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, so they had to move on. On the way, a deadly predator attacked them. But the little one destroyed it using his power. They decided to journey to the home of their nearby ancestors to seek help. Finally, the tired and hungry brothers made it to the home of their ancestors. <laughs> the old wolves invited them to stay. They even took care of them. They were happy to have a safe, warm place to rest. The little wolf Got a even made circus. friends with a raccoon. And together, they went on awesome adventures. Sure. Unfortunately, hunters were hot on their trail and found them. But the tiny raccoon helped the brothers escape and almost got hurt. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south to the distant homeland of their papa wolf. There's supposed to be music here. Man, I love this song. This is my favorite song, guys. Did you guys know it was written by... <laughs> I really felt that. It's the sound of silence. Shit. Daniel, get your ass over here now. <sighs> Seattle, three months before He's the incident. So busted. Pink Panthers and collab win. Of course. Like, I want to play fucking hide and seek. Okay, Daniel. 
No hiding. Man, my brother's a little player. Lila loves it. Oh, no time for this. Where are you? Sean was so much more of a chode at the start of the game than now. True. I would have been pissed if I was there. Oh, asshole. He's got to be in our dad's room. Then. Whoa, hold on. <gasps> Let go. Stop it. Dude, I told <gasps> you to stay out of my room. Ow, that hurt. Yeah, I'm not fucking around anymore. Got it? <laughs> Shit. Do you hear me, Daniel? You shall not <gasps> enter your brother's room. <gasps> Watch out, man! You started it, dickhead! What is this crap? Are you fighting again? You proud of yourself? Stop it! Enough! Getting tired of this! Sean, what happened? Now! Dad! I told him not to come no into matter, my room! Aunt. He never Aunt. listens! He hit me and broke the trophy! He's lying! He always does that when he gets busted! Little shit! Enough! Uh, you both better listen because I'm tired of this crap! Okay? This is my house too, not your playground. You hear me? Oh, jeez. You guys are working my last nerve this week. You okay, mijo? I'm going to talk with your brother. You know the drill. Bedroom and no games. I didn't do anything! Uh-huh. Let's talk. Oh, now. This is so stupid! Bullshit. Okay. You really taught that book a lesson. You done? Hmm? Whatever. Like you're gonna believe me. Daniel's always right. Look. Please? <sighs> Listen, Sean. I can't do this on my own. I... I can't. What did Daniel do? Oh, he, he came into... Help. Sean's room I without you don't want to Daniel. his permission. You grow up, you need space, more freedom. I get it. But we're a trio now, and you gotta take some responsibility. That little shit, he's just a kid. You're almost an adult. I always look out for him. But I can't stop him from creeping around my room. Even you told him. He's just... spoiled. So were you. And you had eight years of being spoiled before you had to share toys with your little brother. I know it might sound cheesy, but we have to be good role models for him. He's a Diaz, right? Does that mean I have to babysit him all summer? Okay. Maybe you're not ready to grow up yet, but you will eventually understand. I'm late for work. Go talk to your brother and work this drama out. We'll go to the movies tonight if you guys don't wreck the house. <laughs> I know you love to hear this. But I'm proud of you. Boobs. Both of you. Okay. Penis. Get back to work. Where's the plant farm? I don't know. We haven't come up to it yet. Need help here. 
be nice and don't break anything. Oh. Can I come in? It's the big, bad brother. know who do this, but it's totally rad. Hey, Daniel, why are you pouting? A young space warrior. He just goes up and molly wops him. <laughs> we need to stand strong against the enemy. He needs to learn Come how on, to sing. Man. I'm running out of punchlines here. <sighs> Leave me alone. Oh, he kept this what? guy. We got him from that creepy circus, remember? We wanted him so bad. Got him for you shooting at that freaking target. Yeah, right. Dad, aim the gun. So what? We still won. We're not my Because of me. Why are you still here? And don't touch my... Hey. That's cool. Did you make it? Be careful. Whoa. Roger. No problem. Suddenly, you're Mr. Careful. <laughs> okay, if I sit down. So, when did you get this? Last month. Dad said I should learn to do stuff. By myself, since we're not around as much. Hey, come on. It's not like I'm leaving home. You might as well. I never see you. We don't even play games anymore. We don't do anything. Daniel, I just... I want to hang out with my friends sometimes. And you're going to be doing the same thing in a couple of years. Hi. I don't want to grow up. It's boring. No. Here. Sorry. Chucky. That's what you wanted. That stupid watch. You said you'd give me one. Yeah, you're low key spitting. True. You forgot. Oh, sorry. Like before. Well, you better keep this watch then. Sean, this is so cool. I'll keep it. Sorry if we're boring. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm just tired. <laughs> Listen here, you little shit. You're gonna grow up and be a slave of a nine to five job with minimum wage, and you're gonna like it. <laughs> Am I hearing? Oh man, I felt that, yeah. Oh hey, look, it's the reason I started drinking. <laughs> Not the drinking. Doggy. You know, sometimes you just need some alcohol in your life to, you know. Does he think Daniel's licking his toes? No, he thinks his dad is licking his toes. Hey, Sean looks good with long hair. I didn't like him with the short hair. He looked like a 
Who said it? Like a chode? Beaver Creek feels so far away. He's giving Zuko vibes now. Dolphin. He thinks he's looking at his... <laughs> looking at his toes. Dolphin 2024. <sighs> Bro's still got the same hoodie. Rocking out. Hey, bedhead. Had a good sleep? Oh, Tatas. Hi, uh, yeah, I, I did. Thanks. Nice. Put them away. I better hit the shower before they use all the water. Right. Um, see you around. Boobas. Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, Sean. Breakfast time. <laughs> this one is Brody's camps. Can you show this on Twitch? A wooga? <laughs> you can, as long as it's not like the center of the. Oh, no more fog. It's like it's just showing. It's just showing Jeez. boobs. It's not like I'm having sex with her type thing. Me out. You don't know what's inside. Most of them are into like fancy them. hippie food. The sun has saved <laughs> Turn off your <laughs> headlights. Man, grass, I'm gonna sit your ass down. What's the date today? Is it the 15th or... What's up, Jake? Hey, Sean. Not much. What do you got going on there? Uh, this is a birthday card for my little sister. <sighs> Don't laugh. I'll get him up before a big girl gets here. Aw. Sure. That's cute. How old is she? She's nine years old now. <sighs> like Daniel. Do you miss her? Who I are these people? Um, oh, you were in here, but... So, Cassidy and Finn, we met them when we were uh, still in Oregon. Um, we were hanging out with uh, Chris, who is a little kid that we saved. Uh, we were hanging out with him and his dad. Um, and we met Cassidy at, like, a tree. We went to buy a tree, a Christmas tree. Um, and we met Cassidy there, and she was talking to us about how they're train hoppers, uh, that they just go place to place. So I'm guessing now we're part of that little group. And I'm so jealous you get to hang out with your brother all the time. That's all these people. But I, I bet it's hard to be his brother and father figure. Neat. These trees are just <sighs> yeah. So gorgeous. I do miss being on my own sometimes. You know, privacy, stuff like that. Really? I hate being alone. Guess I'm used to having people around. Hey, since you're such a pro big bro, what's a good way to end this letter? Goodbye sounds a bit... Lame, right? I'm thinking of you. I do think experiencing a, a mountain lion to experiencing sure a cougar. <laughs> yeah. I'm afraid Sarah's a bit mad at me for leaving her. Anyway, thanks for your help, Sean. I gotta finish this before I get ready for work. Don't want to be late, or Big Joe will eat me for lunch. You and me both. See you later, Jake. I've noticed that the further into the game we get, the more patches my pants have. Um, I think that's funny. Must have coffee. There were also holes in the hoodie. Yeah, I saw there were some holes in the hoodie too. Where's Tata lady? She's showering. Um, I heard nothing, Penny. Ooh. Bonk. <laughs> Maybe it was the coffee brewing. Never mind. You can't hear? Only me. I don't understand. Why? How you miss all those insects? How the fuck? The swarm is coming. You mean... 
Bugs? I haven't seen any flying bugs. The swarm is doing this. what? Sean, Sean, Narc, Stealth Drones, all that shit. Wake up, boy. Look up. You <laughs> saw them? When? They're in their camp area like me. How? Because Vision and Sean, they watching us now. That would be shit for me and Anders to lose the job. The cash is good for us to travel. Same here. Plus, this was a steady gig. I don't want to hit the road yet. Tanya won't either. Don't push out at the narc show. Romero takes care of his P. Yeah, he's a major dick. But fair. He always puts us to work every season. Some of us need this shit job. Not Given the, the collective here. people Cush in this community, am I now the token straight? Then you can work legal on the farm. Right? I think so, yeah. At least from people that are in my chat in pig, consistently, yes. All bad. Woo! <laughs> it's legal in Washington, and it's worked out okay. It's gonna be legal everywhere, soon anyway. Legal but controlled. By who? The bitches who made it against the law. True. I don't know. Things have to change. Oh, um, did anybody see Daniel? I haven't seen him this morning. I saw him walking with. They're friends. talking about weed. They were headed to the lake. Thanks, Ingrid. Oh, she's back for I him. No, that was Finn. Better see what he's up to. Tell him no swimming. At least I think. That lake is toxic, man. Nasty. Pretty sure that was Finn. I don't think that was uh, what's her name. Uh. I think you forgot something. She walked past in the background. You gonna make some more coffee, right? I keep thinking you're Jack. Because Funny how I like Oh yeah, no, it was her. Now. I had you. Oh, uh, you wouldn't hear. Sorry. Me. My bad. Yeah. I Got thought that was coffee, Finn. Boy. We share. Always. No <laughs> way. A long fucking way to work a farm. Yeah. Better check on Daniel. Where's Daniel? Oh, that shit was worth it. Oh yeah, good time. That is definitely the shit bucket. Happy, happy, happy Finn now. You did. Got to ride with us, right? You saw the real shit. True. <sighs> I will miss you too, Kenny. Force choking a squirrel. Is that where Daniel is? He's so good at this. What the fuck, man? You're awesome. Come on, once again. Yes! I fucking rule! <laughs> Holy shit! That was dope! What's up, guys? Morning target practice? Six. Bullseyes in a row. Kid is a fucking ninja. Hey, we didn't want to wake your sleepy ass up. <laughs> yeah, thank you for that. You okay, Daniel? Hey, seriously, I've never seen anyone throw like that. Wow, Finn trained you well. Six bullseyes, dude. Yeah, I got better. Is he cheating with powers? What? Yes. You can't throw a baseball without hitting me in the nuts. How did you learn to aim so good? Not true, liar. You're the one who sucks at baseball. Yeah, right. Hey, wow. What's up with you two? I should have let you know, but, but I'm watching him like a hawk. Seriously, much respect. He's like my own blood. And not that I'm as hot or cool as his big bro. Yo, Sean. Is he hitting on me? Idea. I want to see if Daniel inherited the family blade skills from you. How about a little demo? It was my turn. Come on, let's give the man a chance. Okay. Yeah. Wait, why did I'll he take a tat shot. a chain strip? K 
can't wait for the end when Sean will be like, we did it, guys. We lifed all the strangers. And then Daniel is like, I don't know, Sean. I think I feel a groove coming. And then Sean is like, hit it, Daniel. And Daniel starts the music and all the friends made they made along the way start a dance party. I think I point it a little bit up. Bro. What? <laughs> oh, Sean. Hey, Loki. Shout outs, like shout outs. Thanks for the sub. Better line. Better aim. Aiming is Lucy. Really yeah, the aiming is weird. What's wrong with you? Damn. Come on, sweetie, one more time. I know you can do it. Hello. Be zen, Sean. That's the secret. <laughs> Let's oh, fuck that. <laughs> Miss. See, I rule. <laughs> Sorry, Sean. He used his powers. You're not a ninja, but you're still cool. Just ask your brother for help next time. <laughs> yeah. What would I do without him? Hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault if he can't throw. Woo! After that workout, I need some more fucking Java. Wait! Don't go yet. Uh, it's all good, Daniel. We can practice later if it's cool with. <laughs> I feel like Loki <laughs> simped brother. for this guy. <laughs> Love you, man. Now. For Finn. Where does he keep that knife? Up his ass, probably. You think that shit is funny? What shit? Stop acting stupid. You're pushing it, Daniel. You made <laughs> it. <laughs> no. <laughs> what if he finds out, huh? What then? I'm not stupid. He won't find out. You don't know that. You're gonna get busted, Inano. You need to listen to me. Stop calling me that. I'm not a kid anymore. Daniel, don't Bro, you're lie. nine. Shut the fuck up. See? Stop, Daniel. Now. For what? I said stop, Daniel. Don't run me. Uh. Uh. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be that hard. I'm okay. It's fine. Oof. I told you. You're good, but you don't have control. Daniel's getting his first period. Yet. Yeah, but we stopped training since we got here. We'd rather hang out with your new friends. Well, okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> fit in if we want to keep that job, okay? But you're right. Let's um do some training later today. Cool. Yeah. Let's go by the lake again. But, Sean, how long are we gonna stay here? <laughs> it keeps saying like shit month. like that. It know, snaps me back to reality. To You're welcome. Low, remember? It's gonna take forever. We should try and find mom. You in California? It won't take she that long. Let her now. Although I don't know how low Humboldt County is. No, we shouldn't. I told you a million times. That we can't trust her. She's a bitch. One of the reasons we're out here. That's why we're going down to Mexico. How come I never get to choose? I'm the one with the power. A Karen, literally. Dude, that's how it is. <laughs> Did y'all get your powers at? Okay. Uh, I got mine at around like eleven. That's I was a bit of a late bloomer. Uh, Finn treats me like an adult. Yeah. He understands. Nothing too crazy. Uh oh. 
stupid joke. Hey, Daniel, remember what I said. Low profile. <sighs> yeah. Okay. We're cool. I don't like working on a farm. I know. It could be way worse. We're making cash, you know. Okay, okay. Wish we could send Chris a present. <laughs> ADHD is stigmatism and color blindness all at birth. Maybe just check on him. We will, Daniel, when we're safe and far away. I know. I had fun playing hide and seek last night, especially in the dark. That was cool. Thought Penny might hide forever. Yeah, but we said the trees were off limits. Cheater. Sit here, my man. I need a bodyguard like you. Cool. Tell Sean to give me a knife. My powers of insane depression kicked in around 6th grade, followed very shortly by my mastery of the hidden <laughs> self-deprecation technique. Mind if I sit here? Sure. Hi, <laughs> I saw your tatas earlier. Why so serious? And, um... Uh, nothing. It was a little Just weird. thinking. Cool. I'm always worried about my city boy. Everyone here? This isn't a fucking school bus. We're late. There's a lot of people aggressively hitting on Sean. <laughs> Isn't he? He's still just a kid. He's like 16. He creeped me out. Alex, everyone in this game creeps you out. Hey, little man. So at this point, you know, I'm like, whatever, dude. Knife, just right? give me more booze. <laughs> you know? Yeah. I don't bullshit you. Some gutter punk jump. You're not off. listening to anything I say. So I cut it yet. Are you? Yeah. What? Hey, yes, I am. Cut me too. The party. Oh shit. Oh, Alex, that guy. He's for I sure coming on the say. strongest. What? I was <laughs> I be flashing in the hole. I don't know. I can't trust people. Oh, and Sean does. No way. You He's a big boy, you know. Got it to get out of his way. Smart. Say, if you get too clingy, people run away. I don't know what I'm talking hey, about. Who's the knife master? Yeah, then quit clinging on me. Okay. Did you lock the tent? What if things stop for so near that evening? So? Wrong. How do you feel? Went back for the lighter. Who knew this little tree market snowflake could end up here? <laughs> With us misfits. I actually feel free. It's been a long time. Thanks to you. I hope so. Seems to me, Ben and me had a bet how long you would last. Okay. Please don't hurt me. I lost. Thanks. I'm glad you did. I can't get rid of me yet. Hey, I'm gonna shut the fuck up back there. I can't hear my music. There is no music. Guess what? He was on his secret sat phone again this morning. Speaking Romanian and shit. Oh no. Here it comes. He's agent 420. And he has a license to cook. <laughs> um, what's that? Told you a thousand times, Big Joe is a clone. Romanian? <laughs> from the factory of Silicon Valley. <laughs> Maybe he's just the factory reject. Bigfoot. Think about it. Big Joe. Bigfoot. Whoa, <laughs> you might be on to something. They both smell. Stinky? Big Joe foot. <laughs> Shit, you're all in love with Big Joe. You can't stop talking about him, I swear. But his ass is too big. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. 
Yep. <laughs> He's kind of a mystery. <laughs> hey, pipe down back there. Enjoy the scenery for a change, for fuck's sake. <laughs> hey, yo, his ass? It's a little weird that the kid is making that joke, but okay. Oh boy, we're here. Double cheeked up on a Friday afternoon. Shit, I'm so tired. Yeah, me too. Let's try to go to bed early tonight, okay? Yes, please. And no Life is Strange 2. Oh, How many yeah. title screens? <laughs> well, it's because each one was a, like a released episode. Is that a gun? Man, I'm so fucking tired. Stop your bitch. Oh shit. Hey! Damn, bitch! Hey, come on. That's not cool. Uh, are you really shit talking me, Cheech? <laughs> it's Cheech and Sean. Huh? Forget funny. it, Sean. Seriously. He's strapped! We're late. You're gonna get us kicked out of here. Who is he smack? Well, I just want it to. What? Be a white knight? I can take care of myself, Sean. Bro, Bitch. That guy would have beat you down. Weed. Oh no, he pointed at you. <laughs> I will snap that finger so fast. Wait, I was memeing. <laughs> It's actually we Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I saw the plant and I instantly was like, oh shit, okay. <laughs> this is what we're doing, huh? Oh, thanks for coming. <laughs> I'm not your way, right? No no, we're sorry. We we just You don't get paid to be late. Next time you won't be. <laughs> Listen up. I need two teams today. Finn, Penny. How do you know what we look like, Dolphin? And what your name uh, will clean up the mess from the storm. Uh, the rest of you get to sit and trim. I lived in Oregon. Like I want to go pick up a bunch of shit all over the camp. Hey, you want to trade places? Shut up, Daniel. I dare you got a deal, kid. Yeah! I get to go outside. Hey! You guys still don't get it. This is work, not a goddamn summer camp. You're not special. There are dozens of hippies like yourselves begging for work at the next town. Kid, your dad should teach you to shut your mouth. My dad is dead. Then you better watch your guys. Of course, boss. No problem. Okay, so move it. Yeah. You heard the man. Stop fucking around and get in your teams, all right? Hold up. You and me are gonna talk. Remember, I'm only letting you and your brother work here because Finn put in a good word. I know. We really appreciate it. Ooh, Paul needs to Thanks. shut yeah, his yeah. mouth. No ass kissing, please. Just watch out. Next time your brother fucks up, you're both gone ASAP. Look, I'm not trying to bust your balls, but this is a pot farm and he's a fucking kid. You hear me? Got it. I'll keep him out of the way. You better. This business has enough shit already. What kind of shit? Jesus, what is this, an interrogation? Oh, uh, no, I'm sorry. Okay, time's up. Get the fuck out of here. We got a lot of work to do today. All right, uh, thank you. Hey. 
Okay. You okay? Now for the fun part. I need this all done by tonight. No excuses. So, get on it. All right, we good? Eh, Finn is playing boss with his crew. I told them they'd all work late if they didn't finish on time. I hope so. Okay, I gotta make some calls. Well, what are you waiting for? You know the drill. <sighs> what? Dude, this sucks ass. I feel like I'm in prison. The blatant camera in the corner is wild creepy. He's just recording his own proof. Is she didn't even be here. Sure. I read you wish I wasn't here. Oh, I'll stop. I can tell. You know exactly what I meant. Hmm. Oh, I feel you, Daniel. Sometimes I get stir crazy in here too. Look, I know you guys are having the time of your life here, but I'm not. So shut your mouth and give me some quiet for fuck's sake. Okay? Well, why do you stick around then? None of your damn business. <sighs> but I'd be long gone if I had the chance. Trust me. All right, man. Just pick a bud and get to it. Kids, don't do this. Shit. I hate these scissors. <laughs> more and more like The Walking Dead. I clicked it! Damn. Look at all these buds. Oh, this is nothing. Last spring we were trimming about two or three pounds a day. Whoa, that's a lot. Yep, had to work overnight all the time. 15 hours straight once. Yeah, trying to forget. I was done with Kush after that. <laughs> Whoa. Going too fast. Lucky. Right. Take You're your time, Dean. Fuck all that. <laughs> you got any reception, Big Joe? This place is a cell killer. Oh, of course. Bro, you know that water smells fucking rancid. That's like the equivalent to bong water on God on God. You okay, Sleepy? It's okay. I'm doing fine. Just slow down if you need to. I know. <laughs> no. <laughs> Thanks, Sean. My ass hurts. Fuck, this is really boring. Oh, poor baby. That's the job. Don't think, just work. Okay. <laughs> just don't. How many of these do I need to do? Camera all day long. I don't know. We get paid to give haircuts to marijuana. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Can I'd I post this on this YouTube? Than be in a stupid classroom. Exactly. We don't have any homework. Daniel's doing it, why can't I? <laughs> no. Sure, just Marilyn Big Joe. Whatever. Ugh, quiet! Oh, 
how many of these do I need to do? Damn, Sean. <sighs> you really need to do something about your hair. What? What? What's wrong with my hair? Are you kidding me? It's hiding your pretty face. I can't allow that. <laughs> Come on. Uh. It's not that bad. Just... Just a mess. Yes. But worry not. We've got everything to take care of it at the camp. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll see. Because you are a child, Grace. Daniel is just in a bad situation. But for real, though, if you could snap your fingers and go anywhere. Cassidy, we get it. Over and over. Hey, come on. You don't want to be here. Give me a break. I can't. So what? So I'm allowed to dream a little? You won't get hurt. How much worse can this <laughs> be? Um, what about Louisiana? I don't know. Sweet smells like shit. so, so. sweet this time of year. Yeah. Okay, man. Calm down. <laughs> come on. Dream big. I'd like to see the pyramids. Dude, and you know that the or fucking, your hands would the reek. the top of Mount Fuji. Sean Diaz, global traveler. Yeah. Stalking Humboldt. No. Bitch, bitch, bitch. What's Nobody's this? Nobody's making these babies work here. No fucking. You guys are all the same. Okay. Cool, let's be trimigrants. Then you barely work for a month. <sighs> this is no. my life. Come here for a sec. <sighs> Shit. It's always something. Can you folks put a lid on it? We got shit to do here. Whoa, whoa, down. Easy for you to say, cowgirl. Some of us have to work. Please, I bust my ass like everybody else. Uh-huh, don't even. You're always looking for an excuse. Ooh, it's 420. Hey, Sean, let's talk. Ow, my arm hurts. Wah, wah. Get off my crack, Hannah. <laughs> We've been stuck out here for two months. I didn't come out to California to live on a fucking farm. I want to see some water. Are we going to squat out here forever? Build a house? What? Stop! You know we voted to stay for a while. Once it's legal, Just we ain't got no more job here. How's it going? Let me go. She's still hitting on Sean even when she's arguing. How are we supposed to... I'm just over this place. Then go! Uh, take the fuck off. If we're a family, we stick together. You're on the bus. We're off the bus. Hey, everybody chill. Let's not get- Sean, step back. This is our business. Just grow up, Cassidy. Stop acting like a princess. Thanks, Mom. Anything else? Yeah. Uh, Gotta go by. See Did you, Grease. Have a good night. Wrong side of the tent or what? That's not Shit. my problem, Jenny. You're clueless. You know the drill. Do your work. Yeah. Sure. There we go. Fuck this shit. Hannah, sorry. I know. You're gonna yeah, go to the sea tomorrow. Like I gotta wake up at 3 a.m. Bye bye. Alright, see you, Grease. Keep it fucking down in here, okay? Cheer up, my little Sean. <laughs> Trust me, it's not as bad as you think. Other farms in the area just straight down exploit your ass. 
You gotta be careful with those scissors. They're sharp as fuck. Yeah, no shit. Oh, you'll get scars, but you'll get it. It's part of the fun. I ain't sexier. Oh? Later, Big Joe. Smile, asshole. So, did you have a good day at work, honey? Uh. I did. Love the Jerry Springer moment when Hannah and Cass started picking on each other. <laughs> yeah. They love to start shit with each other. Honey. <laughs> Short term memory loss. How was your day? Did you have fun outside? <laughs> nope. Picked up branches and shit. Got covered in mud. Would not recommend. Still sounds better than sitting on your ass all day. I feel you, Sean. As always. That's why you're such a good fit for the family. You totally hooked us up. A job. Cash. Friends. Safety. Sean. Everybody's cool with you two. <laughs> Daniel is your secret weapon. I don't know. He's way too young for this bullshit. You gotta be zen about this. The more you try and control him, the less you have. It's deep, huh? Swear. He acts just like me. <laughs> That's how I know he's smart. Uh, he's also got a kick-ass hermano. Yeah, <laughs> my brothers are like that. So, what's your story? Um, I mean, you don't have to tell me, but... Yeah, I was pretty lucky. My parents were okay. <laughs> I had three big brothers who spoiled me. Aw, <laughs> you were the baby boy? Like Daniel. <laughs> but my family was kind of... White. Mm, messed up. My dad was like a front for hot cars. Yeah, he'd steal, strip, and sell them. My brothers and I helped him. You know, typical shit. Till we got busted. The fucking feds wanted me and my brothers to testify. <laughs> but my dad narked on us instead. Damn, Finn. That sucks. <laughs> what happened? I went to jail. When I got out, I was like, fuck everybody <laughs> so i hit the road jack and anyways i found a cooler family out here you know i love traveling checking out new things man never gets old <laughs> well going to mexico is the ultimate road trip If we make it there, dude, who knows? It's pretty scary. So fucking far. Hey, hey it is. Uh, but you have time and a strong, uh, damn it, uh, will. Yeah. N nothing can stop you from going there. Uh, it will be all right, Sean. Don't worry. Okay. Therapy's over. Oh. Yeah. I gotta move those water tanks for the shower and stuff. It's cool you're doing your part, Sean. Finally. Glad I can help. He's nice. I don't know why... Why does Alex not trust him? He's a nice guy. Two nights. Oh my god, Alex. So, Hannah, how long ago did you come here to Humboldt for work? Nine years. I left Santa Fe because it was hell. Almost no done. Anybody? Six stores. Worked on How's phones. the dish master? Great. The so much work. Sleepers. How about taking a break to help your big bro move some water barrels? That is awful, Hannah. Yes, but you gotta help me first. I'm on it. 
Step aside. <laughs> yeah, I don't miss doing the dishes. Then why are we doing? Yeah, fuck timers. That's it. Finally. Run away from you near the water tank so we can take on those barrels. Let's get these over to the kitchen in the shower. Okay, let's do this carefully. By the way, you kicked ass today. You have been, all week. Thanks, man. I know this sucks, but you're a good worker. Now that we have a nice stash, we don't have to stay long. I really don't trust these guys. And Big Joe's got 360 vision. More like Big Joe. I hate that guy. Don't let him hear you say that. Seriously. Are you doing the one? He's not funny. That's what Finn calls him. Well, you're not Finn. These guys are dangerous, understand? They don't fuck around. Jeez. Are you scared? You should be. Fuck. We're an outlaw kingdom here. Well, I'm not scared. Your power doesn't make the you second invincible. One. Yeah. It's just here to move barrels around. Living large and humble. Except for the showers and the bathrooms, but won't let me put anything down. <laughs> Think I made some good trims today. And talking with the girls is always entertaining. Where do I put the second one? Where does the second one go? Ah! put this tank next to the kitchen. Oh, the kitchen. I thought it was the toilet. If you like this here, then other places we saw, too many junk teams and only a few. They go together sometimes. No home. Get high. Hey, Daniel. What the fuck else Thanks for saving my back. I owe you. We see so much cool. trash. Hey, you said we could go training today? I did, I did. Ready when you are, young man. Was that not training yes. right there? Let's meet at the lake. Let's go, buddy. Man, trimming sucks. I like Hannah though. Ooh, <laughs> why is that? I don't know. She's honest and tough. Like a warrior. Yeah. Maybe too honest sometimes. I thought that was a good thing. Not when she just likes to fuck with people. Well, she's cool to me. Sorry. He likes her tits. No, that was Cassidy who we saw. Daniel likes dummy mommies. Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Oh, yeah. I can do better with my own skills now. Next level. Onward. Ready to rumble? Fucking A. Let's start with our team howl. Woo! Tias Lobos. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Yeah, we still sound okay. So now, does Camisa. Let's do this. Yeah, Camisa likes dummy mommies. Hold up. It's confirmed. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. 
This is confirmed lore. Hey, you that tree trunk? Duh. Shout out to Rio Ripley. Oh my god! Sorry. Had a moment. I mean, who doesn't love Dommy Mommy? I mean, what? Hey! <laughs> Your face! Come on. I wasn't gonna drop it on you. Very funny, man. Oh my god. Him and Queen Loki are streaming together. Yeah, when I end my stream, I'll go raid Loki. Okay. If we have enough people. Let's have some fun. Think you can lift all those? I know I can. Ooh. Sorry, it was really loud. Nice. Oh, Daniel, that's a, that's amazing. Aw, that's not hard. Hmm, let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Dude, I'll blow the shit out of that. Mm, I'll rephrase that, buddy. Waiting, or maybe you. What the? <laughs> oh, okay. Is that all you got? We're out of sight here. Should be safe. Well, there's nothing else to do, so. Oh, pine cones. Pick a rock. Any rock. <laughs> Damn, Daniel. Okay. And. Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Hey. Awesome. Okay. You're good. Now, let's spice things up a bit. Bring it on. <laughs> oh, hey. That was not a fair fight. That's right. What's next? That was some next level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been training on my own sometimes. I know I haven't been around a lot lately. We still have to be careful with it, man. You always want it both ways. Use it, then don't. We just have to make sure you can control it. Well. It's my power, not yours. Whatever. What's wrong with you, man? I don't like this new emo Danny. You keep throwing attitude at me for no reason. Sick of it. Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people? You're always with them. That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. I bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. He's got powers and puberty. You know it's always you and me, and I know. Stop calling me gay. You mean 
never mind. That's it. Enough. You're being a brat. I can't say anything without you having a shit fit. We're family. We still have a long way to go. I think if I told him that Finn was a bad influence, then he would have gotten even more pissed. Right? I know it sucks. But you have to grow up now. Bro, Daniel looks like Dora. Fuck. Daniel, stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No! Jesus. Damn, Daniel. <laughs> Shit. He's got powers in puberty. Like Bot said. Oh, shit. What's up, Penguin? It's been a minute. How's it going? I got serious munchies. Any chips left? Dude, you scarfed the whole fucking bag. Have another hit. Yeah, yeah. I packed it a fat ball. A little man listens to One Rage Against the Machine album. <laughs> You're getting tired, babe. I'm gonna take a bathroom break. Because it's been four hours. So I will be back in just a second. All right, I'm back. Only one bathroom break in four hours. I'd be like on three by now. Yeah. I don't drink water, that's why. You see my chat drown me. <laughs> There we go. Don't do drugs, kids. Oof. Are we... Oh, shit.
because you're like 10. Daniel! It's like you woke up in a cold sweat. What the fuck, man? I'm getting cross-faded as fuck. You guys, did my thing freeze? It did. Our community. We have this amazing reverend. People line up to listen to her. She's intense. But for some reason... Things happened. Quit looking at me. Started doubting myself. It kind of escalated. People said I was trouble. I couldn't get the answers I was looking for. Even from my own folks. I know the feeling. I felt so lost. Wasn't sure what to believe anymore. <laughs> He's staring at me like I'm an so animal at this I he? left. I just needed to be alone for a while, you know? Find the truth by myself. I'm still looking for it. Jacob, my son. Maybe we are the truth you were looking for. I'm glad I found you guys. I don't know if I'll ever go back there. Not until I get it's a signal giving the from quarry God, vibes. I don't believe in that shit. 
Oh, honey, careful. I hope you and your parents can make up. Don't worry. It's my cross to bear, as they say. What about you, Cassidy? Oh, shit. Your turn. Uh, uh-uh. Pass. I already sang a song. <laughs> Big years. What about you, Sean? You obviously don't have to talk about that shit show back in Seattle. But if you have something else... <laughs> Whoa. No. No way, man. I'm too wasted. How about me? You're the man I was waiting for. It's not only one bad memory, but they're all about my friends. I feel like I've let everyone down. I want to sing. Like Noah and Lila from Seattle. And there's our dog, Mushroom, who was killed by a puma. So we had to bury her. Then I lost Chris because we had to run away again. I know he's not my friend anymore because I lied to him. But more than anything, I miss my best friend, my dad. Jesus, little man. That's hard. I'm so sorry, Daniel. I told you I'd win. You didn't let anybody down. Life did. Yeah. Life is a bitch. We can only go with the flow. Like a <laughs> river. Yeah, that's why I'm not dragging around any bad memories. Come on. Bull fucking Oh, you shit, started this man. shit, bitch. Don't punk out now. Uh, yeah, listen, smart asses. I'm just saying you can't change the past. So you just got to focus on what's next. Hakuna <coughs> Matata. <coughs> Memories. Excuse me. Sorry. Lessons for the future. The future, huh? What's your big plan, Prophet? Want to know what my plan is? Picture this. A kick-ass beach house in Costa Rica. Sunshine, feet in the sand, sweet ocean view. We'd be one big, fucked up, happy, dysfunctional family. We just chill and, and sing and drink cocktails out of coconuts. Only thing we need is a little cash along the way. And then, boom. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That's your dream? Beach house and coconuts? <laughs> oh, uh, too boring for you? This sounds like my post-retirement plan to Florida. I don't need anything else than what we already have. Sure, we're working our asses right now, but we can beat it if we want. I'm not gonna settle down. <laughs> no way. And that's how shit starts, you know? When you start having things of your own, things you ought to defend, property, land, family. What do you think you're missing out on now? He's asking for me. She's giving me um, Dutch from our RDR too. Coconut just... cocktail? Well, agree to disagree. Fucker. He's asking for money. Man, he is I'm Dutch. Too high for your shit. It's time to crash. And penny goes down. Peace out, brother. Night night. Looks like we still have some booze left. Who's in? <laughs> oh, twist my arm. A teeny tiny drink. And we need to talk about Sean's hippie hair. Boy needs a real haircut. Oh, hell yes he does. <laughs> now it's your turn to get a trim. Karma. I'll call it a day, too. Night, everyone. Hey. I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? Oh, sh no, I like, I like, uh, Sean's hair long, yeah. actually. I'm ready to crash, too. Let's go. What? No, you're gonna miss our makeover skill. I'll fall asleep, and then you'll turn my ear off. Oh, get out of here. Good night, then. Night, night, Sweet dream, See you, you in the morning. You didn't have to come with me, you know? I know.
hey, can we talk about what happened on the lake? Yeah. It kind of uh, bummed me out when you said that you weren't a kid anymore. I mean, I know you're not, but I'm going to miss it. I can't help it, Sean. Things are so different now. I miss my friends, my room, my play box, everything. It all seems so far away now. I know I'm not always nice with you, but things aren't nice anymore. I know, but don't let this change who you are. I just wish I could have a normal life again and stop being so angry all the time. Hey. I'm sorry about your bad memory. Thanks. Don't worry. I know You'll that turd hair ain't talking about Sean's Timu wig. New friends. I don't matter. Starting now. Is there, I'm gonna you know, take me off your ears. Best buddies. I'll pickle Sean. My and dumbass just now realizing like that Playbox is literally yeah. the love child of PlayStation and Xbox. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize that either. I just miss them all. Noah, Lila, Mushroom, and even Grandma and Grandpa. I'm just so tired of all this crap. I feel the same way, dude. It's okay. Just don't feed the beast, you know? Yeah. You know, I still like it, but it's kind of tight on me now. Yeah, you're too big for it. I am, but I would like to hear about the Wolf Brothers, if that's okay. Just don't tell the others, okay? Promise. All right. Get comfy. Where were we? Oh. Wolf Brothers joined a pack of hounds that roamed all over. Finally, the brothers had found new friends, but the little wolf wasn't so sure about the new pack. He didn't want his brother to run away with them. And so the little wolf would howl and prowl, not knowing what was going on, but he didn't know that nothing could ever separate the Wolf Brothers from each other. Ever. That was sweet. Me. Oh shit, because he got wasted. No. Ah, more license to music that I can't play. Play. How much more? Oh my lord. We, go we got about an hour left of it. About halfway through. I want to oh, sorry. Um, so the duck walked up to the lemonade stand and he said to the man running the stand, Hey, bump, 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 got any grapes? 
But the man said, no, we don't sell grapes, we sell lemonade. Oh, never mind. And he waddled away, waddle, waddle, waddle. And he waddled away, waddle, waddle, waddle. To the very next day, bum, 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 ba, da, bum. No more lemonade fuckers get to work. I'm dolphin, stop. <laughs> I wonder if I'm missing, like, any... No, okay. I was wondering if I was missing any, like, talking or anything. Harry <laughs> Potter noises is funny! <laughs> The 80s montaging this like it's the power of teamwork. <laughs> yep. That's exactly what they're doing. Okay. This is boring. So, everybody... Tell me how you're gonna blow your next payday. The usual. Save it till the next one. <laughs> well, ain't we all stingy now? How about a keg offering for your family, or... Or some hookers, or cocaine? Oh, please. There's a child here. Mm, I think he's heard worse. Besides, he's our mascot now. Oh, I wanna buy a bacon burger and a pepperoni pizza. Then, a box offering. of Choco Crisps and, and a red slushie. Oh, hell yes. Screw the hookers. Bring on the Choco Crisps. <laughs> Come on, Sean. You gotta treat yourself after all this hard work. Maybe a new toothbrush for me and Daniel. I know you guys dig our morning breath. No. No, we all think it's really hot, actually. So that's it, huh? You bust your ass all week for nothing? Some of us just got simple needs, princess. Yeah. Like your beach house in Costa Rica? <laughs> okay. Let's get this over with. Then... Cassidy, Sean, and, uh, you. Jake. Jake, Jacob. Daniel, dude, do you have to do this every week? Adults only. Oh, whatever. I work too. Yes, I know. But we have to keep a low profile. Got it? For the millionth time. Just wait here for a few minutes, and don't do anything. Nothing. I won't. I swear. Okay. We'll be right back. Ugh. For once, you're all on time. Let's see who wins that farm lotto. Jacob, right? I thought you wouldn't last a day, but you cleaned up. You're all right. Thank you. Thanks. Cassidy, your trims were pretty weak. And Big Joe told me you've been whining a lot. <laughs> there you go. Look, you can bitch all you want as long as you work. Otherwise, you're just taking up space. So get it together. I know, Harold. Now for Sean. Very nice trims. Good work, kid. Finn, you saved the pots in the greenhouse. And our asses. That's why you keep coming back. You know it, boss. Uh, how about a raise? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. 
Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Get in here, you little asshole! What the fuck? Don't touch me, jerk! Don't move. Now explain. That sneaky fucker, he was snooping around your living room. No, he wasn't. I was just bored, so I came in. Uh, shut up, Daniel. Seriously. Let Shh. him go. I told you. Come on, Meryl. He's a kid, not a thief. You want to frisk him? <sighs> Look at him. He's just following his big brother. Your brother needs a lesson. You all need a lesson. So first off, no payday. Uh, oh, fuck that. Boss, no way. Uh, don't do that to us. We earned that money. Sean, you and your brother are, are fired. What? And don't come back or Big Joe will take care of your ass. Please, Meryl. That's bullshit, man. Man, I, I know you're pissed, but Sean is a good worker. Never brought you any losers, right? Sir, quiet! Shut the fuck up. Sean, I warned you one too many times. We tried your way. Now it's my turn. Okay, Joseph. Just teach him a lesson. Let me go! Come on, man. Big Joe, what are you gonna do? He's just a little fucking kid! This ain't your business. Think I like it? It's mine. <sighs> Ow! What? <clears throat> okay, okay, who did that? Who did that? Uh, Big Joe. My friend. Eh. Shit. Yes. Oh. He did. The sexual tension is so thick you could cut it with a knife. Oh, yeah. Well, that's it. Believe it or not. Told you it would sound crazy. Fuck. That's mental. Exactly. I knew something was up with you guys. Damn. I would be scared shitless. We're careful. At least they're not racist. You, true. In case anything happens. And I practice every day. Man. So, Sean. Maybe this shit is in your DNA, too. Do you have a superpower? Nada. Zero. Nothing. Trust me. I tried. Really? When? Do you have any idea where it comes from? I mean, it can't be random. I figured it started in Seattle. Maybe the shock triggered something. Fuck, I don't know. But I still don't remember. Don't worry about it. Damn, you're so unique, Daniel. That's why I need your word that you'll keep all this to yourself, seriously. Oh, this stays right with us. Promise, you can trust us. It goes from the lead in the water. This is a big deal, Sean. How long can you keep this a secret? As long as we have to. It's all about keeping Daniel safe. It's my job now, man. What if he has those powers for a reason? Maybe it's our job to help him too. Guide him. What does he mean, Sean? Dude, no. Do not make this into some cosmic bullshit. You still can't tell anybody. Come on. I wouldn't do that to you, Sean. Or Daniel. Oh, this whole thing just blew my mind. I think I need a break. 
Is that okay? No worries. It's cool. Oh, not after what you guys went through with these bastards. Okay. Talk later. Jacob is going right. to say something. It's fucking bullshit. I know. Finn, do you swear? I mean it. No worries, sweetheart. I'd never let anything happen to that little guy. <laughs> He's a true rebel. Thanks, man. For real. Uh, hold up. You know, there's a lot of money around here. Oh, no. What the fuck are you talking about? Meryl's safe. It's like a fucking ATM. I've seen it. Me too. In the back of the room. How you outlaws gonna get the combination? Me? No fucking way, Finn. Don't pull a kid into your stupid shit. Uh, getting a shitload of cash isn't stupid. We can get out of here. So you can be a beach bum? You're so selfish, man. <laughs> How? Sean and Daniel are out of work. They deserve this. And ripping Meryl off is the only way to do that? Really? And with a fucking kid? You know these assholes are armed, right? I guess. I didn't think about that. Yeah. No shit. <laughs> Don't lecture me. I was just having a brain fart. Let's have a beer and forget about it, Sean. Cool? Deal. Not like I would let you use Daniel anyway. No more of this crap, okay? Yeah, I don't trust Jesus him anymore. He just needs his ass kicked once in a while. I think he did. I can tell he was sorry. For him? Yeah. I'm gonna drink the crap out of this party. <laughs> so should you. Plus, since it's your last night, time for your tattoo. He really is like Dutch. What? Are you getting a tattoo? Dude, I want one. <laughs> no, you don't, hipster. We have other things we gotta do. Okay. I know I shouldn't have gone in there. Who yelled? Now there's three more people who know about your power. Don't worry. We can trust them. They said they won't tell. I know, but what if anyone gets scared and calls the cops? You don't know what can happen. I'm not scared of cops. I can stop them anytime I want. Can we do <laughs> what call the cops or, or trust them? I don't think we can trust them. At least this will all be behind us once we've reached Port Below. <laughs> Have a seat. <laughs> Have a beer. To our last night together. And to your next adventure. Tango's getting a little big for his britches. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. <laughs> so, what are you going to do next? <laughs> Figure out what I'm going to do. Me and Daniel are homeless again. Well... <laughs> When I got out of jail, I had nobody but me. My brothers were still in the joint. <laughs> they still are. I stayed with a friend. Nobody could find me. Yeah, then I just said, I feel like I need to stand up. My ass hurts. And took off. <laughs> that was it, man. No more family. It's weird. Just me. I fell Always down the stairs a long ass time ago. During Thanksgiving. Sorry, I'm stretching. During Thanksgiving, and it like fucked up something. I don't know if I sit in my chair for too long. <gasps> my ass starts hurting really bad. Okay. There we go. Daddy. I just needed a good stretch. That was a great bros. stretch, by the way. Yeah. Everybody, Stupid. you know what? Everybody, let's all get to get out of wherever you are, out of your bed, out of your chair, and, and just get a good stretch right now. I knew. Stretch I it all out. Cut Everyone get off. the big stretch. Start over all for myself. 
No, fuck you. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, you're starting all over. And now, you just got to take the next step to build a something for you and Daniel. Right? Build what? Daniel is acting like such a punk. He doesn't want to listen to me. <laughs> I'm like a parent now. True. But he's still a kid. Can so I raid Loki? Let him hit puberty. He can't stop it. <laughs> Just accept it. No, I can't. Yeah. No, it's gonna be all right, laddie. Damn, they littering. <laughs> uh, have enough cash for the trip? I doubt it, but we'll see. Hey, it's bullshit. After all this, you deserve a lot of life. Seriously. How are you two gonna get to Mexico? I did a jump split. Hitchhike, All right. Walk. Or just hear me out, man. There's only one way out of this for you. One way to hook yourself up. Listen, we got this, Sean. Daniel can open that safe with his eyes closed. Come on. I think um, it's gonna end up doing it anyways. Wasted, like every night. You guys can get to Puerto Lobos in style with a, a nest egg. <laughs> like you don't want Daniel to be homeless anymore, right? Huh? Then let's do this. I wouldn't let you in on this if I had any doubt. You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna put this up to a poll. I'm gonna let you guys decide. Two minute poll. Are we gonna steal that money from the safe from Meryl? Uh, and it'll probably go wrong, or? Are we not going to steal it and just keep going to Mexico as we are? Vote. Let me know. I'm going to wait for the poll to be done before I look at it. Actually, let me check on my notifications while I'm doing this because I know I got like 20,000. Oh my god, please, somebody else vote. Please, anybody, somebody else vote so that I don't have to choose. I'm so stressed. No, someone vote, please. Please, please. Okay. Well. I can't. I can't, Finn. No way. Too dangerous for Daniel. Nah. Nah. D -d Daniel is the dangerous one. Nobody can even touch him. You know it. I said no. Alex, you came back. Too late. To paid. Uh, I would be too. I'm so sorry. But... Okay. Okay. You could have voted in the poll. Don't stress, man. I respect your decision. Just wanted to help you. And Daniel. Much love to you guys. Yeah. 
sucks. You have to go tomorrow. Makes me sad. <laughs> Gonna miss you, Sean. Truly. Thanks, fam. Same here. I feel like he's gonna pull some I'm bullshit. Glad you and Daniel have each other. You two are special. You got power. Don't take shit from anybody ever again. Go on. Get back to your party. Okay, Tom's but done. like they get the money and then what? Uh, yeah. they go to Mexico, Damn but in man. style. Damn, this motherfucker's got a thousand bucks. You need to land, man. I'd rather work my ass off for mom. Shit. Are we really getting kicked out of this place? We don't have enough money to go down to Mexico. What the fuck are we supposed to do? Hey, Daniel. What's up? Nothing. Just hanging out with my friends. Um, okay. I'll just be around. Come get me when you want to go to sleep. Yeah, okay. Talk later. Shit, I am so tired of this. Hey, everything okay? Diaz, my favorite straight A student. I'm gonna leave you guys alone. No, don't. I can go. If I'm interrupting, or. Don't worry, we're done. I think I need some alone time anyway. See you later. Cheer up, sister. What's going on? Don't worry about that. Secret girl talk. Wing Manning 101 right there. I'm so bummed you guys are leaving. No shit. Are you still going to Mexico? Yeah. At least we have to try. It's cool you have a goal. I can't wait to get the fuck out of here. But they want more cash. Then Finn likes to get his lead on. Um, why don't you come with us? Is that? <laughs> I'm Easter? glad we agreed. Yeah. <laughs> why not? That's so sweet, Sean. But I'm not cut out for that life. I can't stay in the same place. I need to move. See places live and the last thing daniel wants is me bumming around with you two <laughs> whoa down fuck that shit it's fiesta time even if it's our last night here we'll you two do is move what is she on about one thing i learned traveling is how small the world is and we already met twice why not more even if we don't There'll be fucking cool memories in each other's minds. <laughs> yeah, maybe. But the best way to remember somebody is a tattoo. A tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Wait, I knew it. This is like your initiation ritual. Don't be scared. Cass is here. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I'm never yes. gonna, uh, as, as somebody who has tattoos and who is addicted to tattoos, not in a bad way, um, I will always say yes to a tattoo. Let's do it. Especially for free? Yes! Yes! I gotta get my first Here one still. Ooh. What's your favorite game? Hi, Matt. <laughs> yeah. One, um, two, I'm not three, sure four, I'm five, joking. six. I'm at six. It'll be super cool. I swear. So, what do you want? Think hard. Unless you count <gasps> a wolf. Um, a wolf. Unless you count Thingy? two of them as but separate pieces. Cream. Okay. Boy, you um, won't be disappointed. In which case, it would be tattoo, one, two, three, four, right. five, six, seven, Put eight, nine, ten. Here. But I yeah, think okay. the other number is better. Uh, just six. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you've hey. talked about it. Don't move, sweetie. <laughs> But it fucking hurts. <laughs> what did you think this was? Doodling on your arm with a pen? Don't worry. You won't feel the pain. Eventually. Better? Mm-hmm. Dude, that's a stick Not and poke. That shit hurts. 
At least I'm sure you'll never forget me now. Where did you get your tattoos? <sighs> Shit. Lots of places, dude. I get new ones all the time. Often when I'm bored or drunk. Tam didn't want to flirt. I see you. Do they all mean something? Nah, I just got them from people I met. Friends, lovers, <laughs> strangers. That's what I care about. <laughs> Whoa. You're like a living canvas or something. Exactly. That's what I like about tattoos. Gives me a piece of everything I want to remember. It feels good. Especially when you can't help leaving stuff behind. It does sound good, Cass. I get it. I feel like we're flirting no matter what. I just say toys for your gay son. And... I'm done. Can oh my finish? god. It looks good. Thanks a lot. I love it. It's on my body forever. How do you like it? This will keep it warm for the night. Sis! <laughs> You'll need to buy it's a little silly. Hey, you know what? I think I'll have a swim in the lake now. Oh! Come with me. I think we're going skinny dipping. <laughs> Iron deficient asshole. Cool. Hope I don't look like a clown. I actually kind of get why they all wear tattoos. Feels like you belong. I prefer to chunky <laughs> instead of skinny dip. It's chunky dunk. <laughs> yeah. Cassidy's crazy. Me too. <laughs> so don't make her wait at the lake, dude. Sean. I don't now they cover it. See, I told you we're skinny oh, dipping. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Woo. Yes, I'm in. What are you waiting for? Oh, fuck this. It's freezing. <laughs> it's all in your head. Just don't think about it. <laughs> uh. He gets in, he skinny dip, he gets in, and it's just, I swear my dick isn't small, it's just cold. Sure, uh, don't think. Oh, shit. <sighs> okay, here I come, I think. Turtle is yeah, in the yeah. shell. Get over it, hurry oh up. Oh my god. There you go, bring it home. <laughs> hey, you gotta take it all off. No cheating. Oh, shit, shit, shit. My, my balls. Mm. <sighs> Cassidy, do not even. <clears throat> you are so adorable. Yeah, I know. <gasps> okay, mm, I hate to, I hate to, erm, um, actually, but as a person with tattoos, this is killing me. This is hurting physically. That thing is gonna get so infected. <laughs> it's, it is, I am physically wounded right now. <laughs> this is horrible for the new ink. Not, not just, bad. not just new ink, just any kind of injury <laughs> that is... Dirty ass water. <laughs> yes. Didn't think you'd actually do it. Okay. My body I'm, I'm just good. Had to get used to it. Not that cold. That's because I had to pee. Ha 
Ha ha. So, what are you gonna do about Finn and, you know, his plan? It's a really stupid idea. Way too dangerous, especially for Danny. I know. Finn acts like this is no big deal. But the steel is bad. It's only dirty ass water because they're nude before it was just dirty stuff. water. Yeah. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> He's gonna be pissed. He's your brother. Mary Leeches. So listen here. Finn wants to take care of us, but but he doesn't always see other people. It's all about him. I know. Snapping I turtle! <laughs> Tell her age for a while. Alligator. Sure. Actually, I don't think there's <laughs> alligators in Oregon. Like Wait, no, you. California? No. I doubt it. What do you mean? Come on, heartbreaker. You know everybody likes you. I plead guilty. Yeah. We gonna kiss? We gonna kiss? Oh, Sean. <laughs> Are we gonna kid? Is fish swimming into her hoo-ha? <laughs> Ew! Bust out this line whenever you go skinny dipping. First time, I swear. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> you sure? I'm not that much of a player, as you can tell. Hmm. I don't know. We're both already naked. Hey! Hey! hey. That's Social distancing. Stay six feet apart. I am a. I, uh, no. Your fault. Not that I mind. So do I need to, like, do I need to, like, close my door? Or something? Should I? Yeah. Do you want to kiss me? Yes. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a... <laughs> I'm gonna go close my door real quick. <laughs> just in case. I don't think it needs to happen. It's just, listen. There is, in fact, a child in this house. I have to cover my ass just in case. <laughs> close this door and fluster. <laughs> no. Look, my little brother is in the room next to me. I don't want him seeing things, you know? His poor, innocent child mind. I do. If that's cool. Yeah. Boobies. See? Alright, kids, close your eyes. Close your eyes, kids. He's leaving tomorrow, though. Now. Let's get out of here. Like, in a... My eyes are wide open. <laughs> Damn, Sean. You really are cold. <laughs> she said he has a small dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's so bad. Shut up. Stop looking. She dunked on his ass. I like her shoulder tattoo that she has. It's like a little mermaid or something, like a lady. For why are you looking? Why wouldn't I? <laughs> but hold on a sec. Are they going in her tent? Okay. It's been worse. Sean? Hello? You want me to come inside? <laughs> such a child i am a 22 year old child oh god <laughs> you know what if i rephrase it 
it. If you want to. Sure. Uh, yeah, I do. <laughs> Should I put my be right back screen? <laughs> it's just I watching. I... <laughs> Wait, I want to see. I want to find. I want to find a, a thing. I need to know if. Okay, I need to know if it shows anything. So I am gonna look up a guide, to see. Okay. There's a little bit of Tata, and that is it. There is nothing too explicit. At least I don't think so. They kiss a little, and then there's a little bit of Tata. Trying to find a sex percent speeder on PG3. Surely it wouldn't. Then get in, bro. Alright, boys. Sorry for the mess. Porters rejected my application. If anybody is gonna be uncomfortable, click away now. Again. <laughs> <laughs> of tongue instead of tata. Is that a tampon bag in the back? Why the zoom in on the chips? I don't know. Are you cool? Um, totally. Uh, I'm just nervous. <laughs> she pulls out a massive. Kind of oh my god. Till now. No shit. I need to know. You're kind of real quick. a pro player, dude. Now we're all cozy, right? Yeah. Um, hey, listen. I, I think you should know that I'm... Uh, I know. Don't worry about it, okay? Hmm. So Sean is... Sean is 16, we know this. Um... And people headcanon cast as 18. There is no, like, confirmed age for her. Is there supposed to be music here? Her armpits! Oh my god! <laughs> nope! That is the biggest nope of my life! <laughs> today i she's not transformed but it's just she hasn't shaved but oh my god <laughs> so much i think she has more than sean <laughs> holy fuck oh that was funny bitch smuggling a furby <laughs> holy shit hot as a ball in headlock that's no for me love Ah, uh, more licensed music. Extra. <laughs> Y'all need to stop. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry to anybody watching this VOD right now. Oh, wait, hold on. There might be more. Okay, no, there isn't. It's just them. There's no more booba. It's covered by her arm. We're good. Sean, 
sniff <laughs> or what I said was okay. The boobs <laughs> by the armpit. Oh what my that? god. Nothing. I just never mind. <laughs> Enters the avatar state. Come on. Talk to me. Sorry, I am. Uh... Sorry, it sucked. Sean, this is your first time. I won't give you a bad review online. Oh, that's uh... he. <laughs> okay, I still want to put this on YouTube. He arrived too quickly. Sweet, Poor guy. But you don't have to be like that. What the fuck? <laughs> hey. I mean it, Sean. Uh, NSP made a song Take about this, I think. You'll have time to practice. Okay? He's not staying. Okay, we need some fresh air. Let's get dressed. I'm Bro, you know that again. tent s smells musty as fuck. Bro, that tent probably smells like shit. And take two. <laughs> no. Sean. It's all good, okay? Hey, what's happening? What didn't happen? Wait, <laughs> must see. did you guys just have sex? Yeah, <laughs> kinda. Uh, yep. Did you see Finn? He was with Daniel, but now I can't find him. Shit. Well, you didn't see anybody out there. But... Shit. We better go now. Figures Daniel is with him. Just tell Finn I want to talk. Thanks much. Later. Sean, hold up. Wait a sec. Why? We have to stop them. Let's figure out a plan first. We don't have time for that shit. <laughs> it really is The Walking well, Dead. We have to get to Merrill's before then. You're right. He's going to pull out the Maybe if only I didn't sleep with Jewish you. Trucks. Stop. I told Daniel. <laughs> Fucking Finn. Hey, get mad later. We got shit to do now. Well, they're not arguing. They're just... If something happens... Fuck me. It's okay. She already okay, did. Then. Bring them back. Thanks for coming with me, Cassidy. Don't thank me. I'm gonna kill Finn myself. Can't believe it. Don't stop. We were gone. What? I'm not wrong. Minutes? Twenty. First, I get laid. Then my brother goes on a hunt. What? Somebody build the lock. <sighs> of course. We probably gotta check a car. One truck is missing. See? Ten Those minutes. Someone's feeling out. confident in his ability. Fuck. At least they didn't wait to Ten show minutes. Up. But if we do, <clears throat> he'll kill us, Sean. So let's not advertise. No lights, no noise. I'll check the car, you do the truck. Figures. Check the other door now. Maybe the car then? Cass, check it out. So, all the doors are locked, but we just gotta get into one car. And I think I can get that truck started. You shitting me? That's what I was just thinking that. Didn't he had a dog? He was a mechanic. He, he once showed me how to hotwire his tow truck, just in case. Sean Dean. You're full of surprises. Plus, we could, uh, mess with all the other cars so Big Joe can't follow us. Love the way you think. We can find some things here to bust shit up. But we can't make a sound. Sean, I checked the car. All doors locked. Of course. Keep looking around. We need to find a way to open that trunk. <coughs> Th 
He's not talking about mush. He's talking about this guy. Joe had a thing. Had a dog. Has a dog. Nothing over here, man. Don't be too loud. <clears throat> We won't be working here anymore. Oh yeah. Maybe this fits in one of the so cars. Fucking stupid. It says office truck, idiot. That's isn't that gonna be really loud? There she blows. fun. You're not gonna follow us now, motherfucker. I meant to try the keys. <clears throat> Come on. Don't tell me they're for the car. Completely blowing their cover, yeah. Just gotta get in that truck and start her up. Mm. Just wanna get back in my thing. I'm not creeping out here. I already looked in the boxes. Anything useful in this junk? He's just right over there. This plan is crazy. Hurry up, Sean. Uh. Score. Hammer. By the way, Sean. That was nice being with you. <laughs> Not Same. the time! Same for me. Now let's get the hell out of here so we get another chance. Not the time, bitch. Big Joe seems like the kind of guy to shoot first and ask questions later. Oh yeah, 100%. Because he is, yeah. Oh, we're too slow, Sean. No. -uh. Here it goes. That's going to make One, so much noise. Two. Yep. Coming, let's go. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. What the hell? They'll be on us in any second now. This is not fuck, obvious. Sean, you did it. Let's get out of here. Drive. Fuck this shit. We did it, but it was so close. Let's do this. Why is she still whispering? 
Why is he saying it like that? I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm just a dreamer. Say that. Things can't go wrong after the night we've had. This is basic karma. Shit. Right. Got about ten I minutes left, by the way. Continue, Cass. <laughs> we should go. I'm just a kid not, not and life here. is a nightmare. She still won round two. <laughs> oh, Finn is out of control. Has he done this before? Fuck us over? No. Not like this. Why now? Because Finn thinks Daniel wants his golden ticket? It just gets greedy. I'm stupid. We gotta catch him. The bonk. I just don't know if we can ever trust Finn after this shit. I wouldn't. Hannah is gonna go ballistic. Guess you have to tell her too. Hell yeah. She knows how to deal with his ass. Let's deal with this situation first. Shit, the CCTV is gonna be bad. Ah, oh, shit. You scared the shit out of me. Good. What the fuck are you doing? Didn't we settle this, man? Shh. You're gonna wake Meryl. Finn, no fucking way. Come on, Sean. Are you kidding me? How could you do that, Finn? When you're so fucking kid, he's nine years old. He asked me for it. I didn't force him, man. Are you an idiot? He's too young to make that kind of decision. For fuck's sake, Finn. He's an old soul. He <laughs> knows up. what's up. Hold on, please. You're standing near a boatload of cash. We can do this in five minutes, in and out. And then you're off to Mexico. You won't hear about me ever again. We got this, man. Trust me. No means no, Finn. Meryl is right fucking there. Uh, he's a log. Won't even know. Asshole. I want to help, Sean. We could get out of here. Go to Mexico. Ah, uh, shit. I feel like if I say no fucking way, it's gonna happen anyways. Gotta go as in what, bot? Do it? Big Joe isn't- I mean, at most he's walking because we punctured all four tires on that truck. Okay. Yes! Let's do it. Seriously? Cass, we have to do this. He's leaving tomorrow, Elsa, so... Fuck. Just be your back on here. Sean, don't touch me. Man, you're so stupid. I can't believe this shit. Hey, the post no on stress. Me. She'll cool down when she sees us come back loaded with cash. We don't need her, Sean. Six. <laughs> we sneak in. Daniel opens the safe. We grab the money. Then get the fuck out. Sound like a plan? Dude, I can feel it in my gut. This is a bad idea. Mm. 
Yep. Well, well, well. Come on in. Yep. They're all here. You were right. Fuck. God damn. Damn. You little assholes had to fuck with my trucks. Joe, watch those punks. I'll take care of these ones. All right. Move your asses over there. Uh, Meryl, now. Uh, <laughs> boss. <laughs> I know this looks bad, but stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. So, what was your big fucking plan exactly? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. Who was the moron mastermind? Like I didn't know. I gave you punks work when nobody would. A place to crash for free. This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? Uh, no, no. Hey, it's not about you. I thought you were different. Smart. But you're a real dumbass for getting a kid involved. And you're teaching him how to steal? Thief and brother of the year. Nice. <sighs> what now? You all really fucked up. I can't just let this slide. I can't. He's gonna you're call young, the cops. but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your heads. Don't do this. Don't. Come on, sir. We... We could talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now! Nah, bro. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm gonna obey Dude, that shit. Yes. He's got a shotgun, bitch. <laughs> I'm not gonna discuss it. The fuck? <laughs> on knees, okay? Meryl? No. Don't break my balls now, kid. Daniel, you've got this. Don't move. He can't <gasps> do this. Don't <gasps> fucking move. not like I want to do this. The people I deal with are worse. But if you rip me off, you rip them off. Then I pay. I have a family to look after too. I gotta protect them first. Can't let you play me anymore. Bro, he'd be killing a family. Like, not a family, sorry. He'd be killing a human. He's nine. I can't have him kill a fucking human. That's a person. It's different when it was, a like, an animal because... I don't know, it's just an animal, but, like... That's a person. No, don't ask. Yeah. Meryl, just listen. <laughs> Please, boss. I know. I got greedy. I, I was high. Stupid. I I I'll make it up. I know. No, that's gonna... He's gonna kill him. You will. <laughs> Bro, that made me jump. <laughs> That made me jump! Holy shit! Daniel, don't look. Look at me. No! Listen. Don't look. No! No! Shit. Shit. Daniel! Stop! It's your fault! You hated me! Daniel, listen. You fucked everything up! Oh shit. He's going carry on our asses.
bro. Cass has to come back. Ooh, no, that's a better reference. All because Finn died? Well, he looked up to Finn. Down 11! Is all that money? Yeah. And he died anyways. <laughs> he did. <laughs> Yep, Finn's dead. <laughs> He's wearing a bulletproof vest. Damn, bro, look at all that Benjamins. Actually, I lied, that's a $10 bill right there. Damn. I saw the shoes and thought it was Daniel at first. Yeah, me too. That's, uh, that's Sean. Did I kill Sean? Did I kill Sean? No! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> oh. Ruh -ruh, Raggy! <laughs> I knocked my chair over. Fuck, wait. Give me a second. Bro! Ah! Dude! Fuck. Wait. My chair is all tied up in my pants. In my pants from the other day that I just threw on the floor and didn't pick up. Did I kill Sean? <laughs> Oh my god, there's no way! He has to have protagonist! How long is the next chapter? Fuck this game, dude! What chapter are we on? Three? How long is the next chapter? Fuck, it's two hours! I can't. I'm tired. Yeah, the Okay. Plot armor. Uh, your trimming was average. You didn't trim very efficiently. Trimmed a lot of weed buds. Wait, scroll through these pages. Oh yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, you helped Daniel clean the dishes. You were wasted at the campfire. 
You went to sleep with Daniel. Finn came forward with Daniel when Daniel hit Big Joe. You were eventually convinced to take part in the heist. You and Finn remained friends. Me and Finn could have kissed? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> you kissed Cassidy, you went to Cassidy's tent. Uh, you sabotaged Big Joe's vehicle so he wouldn't come after you. You snuck into Meryl's house without being noticed. You alerted Meryl while sneaking into his house. You came in after Finn and Daniel broke into Meryl's house. Cassidy can be injured. You did nothing and Finn wasn't killed. You told Daniel to use his power and Finn wasn't killed. You shot Meryl and Finn was killed. You didn't take the gun from the safe. Daniel waited for you in the morning. Daniel had your help doing the dishes. Daniel helped Sean carry the water cans. Daniel talked with Sean about his anger. Daniel stayed put but lashed out after Finn died. Yeah. Finn was shot dead and Daniel lashed out at Sean. Daniel disordered and used his powers and got injured. Oh shit. Daniel used his powers, got injured, and lashed out. Damn. How much is this game? Uh, I don't know how much it is. Exactly. You have to- I'm pretty sure you have to buy every individual chapter, which sucks, but- This is it, son. You're toast. End of the road. No way out this time. We got a lot of room in jail for cop murderers like you. You're alone now. Alone. Where's Daniel? Is this chapter four? It's a like a teaser for chapter four, yeah. Is that grown up Daniel? There's no way. Dude, what the fuck just happened? What just happened? Every episode, episode one and two were boring as fuck. Nothing happened. Nothing, you know, aside from our dad dying. But, like, nothing crazy happened. And then episode three, we have sex. And then suddenly, one bitch dies. Uh, Sean might be dead. Cassidy's okay, but Daniel is God knows where. There's only five chapters. Yeah, there's only five chapters. Oh my god. Holy shit. That was... That episode was good. That was a good-ass episode. Alright, I am gonna end stream here because I'm tired as shit. Thank god our Queen Cassidy's okay. Um... Whoever, here, prediction, uh, I did not cry this, well, no, yeah, no, I didn't cry. Um, congrats to all of you guys that got your points back. Uh, I'm gonna stream this again tomorrow, um, because, holy shit, um, we're gonna raid Loki. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, I will see you guys again tomorrow, um, Go tell Loki, uh, Dolphin, Raid, uh, help her get to Affiliate. She's trying to do that, too. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Um, get in the raid. Yell out Dolphin Raid. Send her a few Apollo emotes. She's the one who made them. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time.